Ah, oh, dude, I passed the seventh gym. No, I know. If you get a ditto, okay, wait, first of all, friend code. <laughs> Just tell me this is being recorded. Yep. At least it is because I think. This tail end is being recorded. <laughs> Talking about your nerd stuff. Uh, Look at those Mr. Sad. Dungeon Master. Exactly. Look at those you sad. Talk. Yeah, quit, ru <laughs> quit ruining my jokes before I finish them. <laughs> <laughs> I was only going to say, look at them sitting there playing with their Pokemon nerd shit. Now let's get back to D&D. <laughs> <laughs> no, you had to ruin it. Last time we played, I got something awesome. Well, technically the party got something awesome, which you're currently controlling. <laughs> yes, yes. Therefore, the... I shall keep control. Yes. We got the awesome device. Hot device. No, I was quiet until yesterday. Totally. <laughs> <laughs> Air Force and Comet. Did you get my email? The DM I forced. Any objections like that? He's like, I'm just gonna push. Did you, you uh, decide to not so gently help me in the direction I, think I, I want you to go? Yeah. 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 Does Gouji have his own sign of stats? <laughs> I'm glad you asked. Yay! Have a Gouji. Thank you. Woo! <laughs> Gouji, one of those kind of reflections. Oh, that's right. That's our sisters. He's had his spikes taken off, but yeah. he still has punching. Yeah. Please let that be her magical artifact thing. <laughs> no, she already has one. <laughs> Do you have She's just not braggy, she doesn't share it with the party. <laughs> I'm not braggy. <laughs> it was just obvious. Sure. And I, and no, I had to tell everyone that in order to get it. Watch and I didn't have to, I just chose to. <laughs> yeah. Like a good member. <laughs> when has he ever concealed what his act does? <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not like him out on that. I'm he's probably saying. stopped you. So he's probably woken you up at the night to say, Did I show you how awesome this thing is? And you're like, Fuck yes. <laughs> I'm trying to trance, you asshole. I'm trying to talk to the other things in my mind right now. I gave you fucking 16 hours a day. You can't give me four? God damn it. I, I think a day is longer than that, buddy. Fuck you. <laughs> Wait, you're not counting those mystical four hours where time stops, are you? <laughs> uh, how long will this journey be? Hmm? You know, from point A to point B. I'm pretty sure it's a couple of hours between the couple of days. Couple of days. Yeah. Yeah. We're, on a boat. We're on an ocean, and there's a section of the DM guide with monsters in the ocean. Yeah, yeah. I want to take the opportunity yeah, as if, as if to, we're gonna pass that out. Uh, uh, spread the vines more. around like the edge, like so if anyone tries to climb up, they got this little thing that can hold the injury. A little bean for the cannon. <laughs> I take Have it. we we've left already, right? So do you put a saucepan on your head and you do it? <laughs> there was we, something else I wanted to cover with you actually. Oh. Okay. Before we leave, I actually Which take the, the time to go buy an iPad. You must finish or raid the uh, place where you call it Alice Dean. Mm. Uh, the place was mostly yeah, abandoned just, just earlier. There were signs that there might have been oh, other yeah. people there at times, <laughs> but it looks like it was just her staying here. Along with probably <laughs> about four other people. Mm -hmm. like, like there's beds for them, but their stuff is not there. Yeah, they're, they're not there <laughs> yeah. currently. I'm trying to while you're wearing And one of the beds looks like it has not been slept in in a long time. Mm -hmm. At least like a few weeks. Mm. And lastly, there is mm -hmm. that, uh, a place she followed Alice to. Okay. Inside, during the fight, Alice uh, took some time to try and attack Gouji. This proved to be less than successful. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Wait, did you fight Alice? Yes. <laughs> Apparently, Gouji did. <laughs> Woo! Gou Gouji, her, and a large contingent of watchmen did that she brought in. Did you snap her out of it? <laughs> I don't think we managed. That's up to you. Yeah. Well, she probably <laughs> snapped something. Because uh, I was able to snap. Marcus out of it. Are you going to try and bring her down on the floor? Let's try and do that. Alright. Mm -hmm. During the course of the fighting, she did manage to run through a couple of the Watchmen. They didn't immediately die, though. Something odd happened. Did they, they get all robotic and weird? No, they turned into stone. Oh. Well, that's not good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. How do you not notice that right away? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, yeah, there's something weird about him. Oh, oh, he turned to stone. I don't know. Well, he was always a little bit out, so. <laughs> I call cockatrice. Oh, I thought it was a skin condition. I call cockatrice on this shit. We, we listen to her for cockatrice, I guess. <laughs> uh, it looks like um, during the fight, it, it seemed to happen when she stabbed them. Mm. It might be a property of her sword or of her. <clears throat> You're not sure. Uh, you managed to bring. Don't get stabbed, guys! You managed to bring her down. <laughs> 
You managed to bring her down by having Gouji, having Gouji essentially ta spear tackle her to the ground and just sort of sit on her. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to get up when there's a you know four ton robot. <laughs> nope. <laughs> hey, get up. He's nope. named Vlad. <laughs> Vlad. No. It's Gouji. <laughs> it's Gouji, your metal pal who's fun to be with. <laughs> With a dark past. past. <laughs> he does have a dark past. Well, those are all robots that were up He had a rough up for him. Because it seems like a new generation. He lost his yeah. best friend recently. He did. <laughs> was his best friend or his most uh, hated co worker? That would be hell, wouldn't it? Everyone else, the job is dead except you and the one guy you hate. <laughs> Isn't that the premise of Red Dwarf? Yeah, basically. <laughs> So you really dead. do follow one of these. Uh, Everyone is dead, died. With some handy injections of various mysterious concoctions <laughs> on your part, you managed to uh, snap Alice out of it. She doesn't remember much of anything she was doing. Hmm. The last thing she recalls was being in her family's estate, which is sort of up to the north quite a ways. Hmm. She doesn't actually even know where she is immediately. Oh. Uh, she does demonstrate an ability to fix the petrified watchman by Yay! touching them. Okay, so it was that was that was part of her power then. Mm -hmm. oh. You did roll me a streetwise check. Well, do you have or a history check? Do you, have hmm? do you have confirmed with spirits? Talk to them about her past. Mm -hmm. Would that work? I thought it was more like inanimate. I think stuff. it's for talking to inanimate stuff. Yeah, more spirits of inanimate things. Like, tell me your the sword. Ass. What the sword witnessed? We could, we, well, like if the sword is like, like, that like his... That requires a sword to have an intelligence. Yeah, <laughs> not, not every weapon is blessed like that. Oh. <laughs> um, 19 on his Damn it. Okay. You do know that uh, turning people to stone is actually a hallmark of the Gravel Stroke family. That's oh. how they got the name. Oh. When they stabbed someone, Wait, they turned into a statue. Okay. Didn't we hear that Alice was going to the island? She was planning to. Along with the rest of her family. Okay, Recon. What Recon? Last game. We're just like, like, doing what? We, you said Alice was headed to the island and we're like, we chase her. As far as you know, she was. Okay. <laughs> does, she, does she remember having any dealings with the Red Cloaks at all? She does not. Okay. The watch should... is quite happy to put her under arrest, though. Whoa! Well, she's under uh, the retired uh, right now. <laughs> and then she'll be under arrest. I, can I see? Can I say that you're Dorothy, not there? Can I say that Dorothy would know better? The, <laughs> like, would know that the watch should know better to do that because she would know that there's another grapple stroke out there hunting her down, potentially gonna kill some watchmen. Her brother? Yes. I and. wouldn't have known that though, <laughs> unfortunately. You should. Uh, you know Mar that Marcus is around. I think we saw him. You don't have any idea what his intentions are though. Yeah. Get his sister back. But, but once we meet up with each other, Stand you can tell me that reason. information. <laughs> anyway, be prepared for the info dump. Speaking of, uh, you do meet up with um, Darius, mm. who Darius evidently is the person who Hawklight sent to follow mm. the Sky Pillar Mage. Mm. He informs you that he followed him to a group of a number of other mages from the Sky Pillar, oh. all exhibiting very similar dead eye traits, mm. who were all carrying the supplies. Really? Mostly mm -hmm. like food, clothing, things like that. Okay. Uh, he then followed them to docks, uh -oh. hmm. where they, along with three people who Darius recognized as other members of the Gravel Stroke family, huh. were boarding a ship. He was not exactly able to thwart this. <laughs> <laughs> Just by himself against everyone. He managed to get the uh, Port Authority workers on the dock to delay the ship, to basically hold it up with some nonsense Paper. paperwork, busy work and stuff, <laughs> yeah. to at least <laughs> slow it down a bit. We have to re-examine your barrels of rats. Hey. <laughs> we don't have any barrels of rats. Sorry, we need to re-examine all those barrels of poison you bribed us to ignore. Someone else bribed us to bother you about them. <laughs> <laughs> they're very upfront with their corruption. Yeah, they're just work for the red cups. Says here you have five barrels of poison. You can see nine barrels of yeah. black ghost toxins. That's only personal limit. <laughs> Sorry, you're only permitted to carry eight of this manifest. <laughs> oh, would you like a sample of one of them? Nope, mad different to you. <laughs> anyway. Uh, eventually, this uh, took you basically the evening to follow her, and then the next day was the rain. You're walking back through along the docks district, 
basically going to speak with the dock master and find out what was going on with the ship and more about it. Wait a a weird boat shows up out of nowhere. It's got sort of <laughs> ragged sails. Hello! Vast, ragged like, non-sailors on top. It looks, like, it looks like maybe it hasn't been used in about a hundred years. <laughs> it's like, how is this, like, how is this seaworthy? Like, like, you, also, you mostly hear a large crash coming from the direction of the sticks distance. Uh, <laughs> you also see, you, you see a, a familiar drought at the wheel of the boat. <laughs> Your perception yeah. is actually pretty high. You might be able to make out the fact that some of the crewmen walking around on the deck are skeletons. <laughs> no, sir, no. Are those really like anorexic surveys? They, they were leaving at that point, so she would see them going down there. Okay, well, you do manage to catch sight of the fact that as the boat is sailing out the uh, deep section of the harbor, it changes shape. <laughs> He was. <laughs> Very subtle, guys. Oh, well, it, starts out as, it starts out as basically a large, what looks like a cargo ship or a yacht. It changes shape, becoming low, thin, two-masted schooner. <laughs> basically in the form of something that you would generally regard as looking like a blockade runner. Oh, no. <laughs> something that's used in a trade that involves speed. <laughs> like piracy. <laughs> or, you know, privateering. Oh, that's not good. Anyway. Oh, it's like a there's ship, a it's difference. A ship, it's a ship. Technically, there's a difference. <laughs> one extinction. <laughs> one, one loot and attack merchants. The other are sanctioned by the government to loot and sink pirates. Usually, waiting until they actually attack the merchants so that there's a good haul. <laughs> <laughs> They're not really any better. <laughs> Their difference is they get paid on both sides. <laughs> Oh boy. Anyway. Well, I need to get on that ship. <laughs> this boat uh, actually docks in the harbor uh, and you can head open to meet up with the party. Mark again! You hey! Do miss one of what we got! Uh, there, uh, you see a drow trying to toss an old man off board. Oh yeah. You see a drow successfully toss an old man off board. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> which like... I managed to catch. You stopped no. him the first, first time. <laughs> that was right. <laughs> that was right. The sticks. Right. Yeah, he got to the dock. And then you paid him. And I'm like, whoop! And then you throw him off, but he wasn't so fussed about it. So he was like, ha ha ha, a bag of gold. And then he landed at the harbor, and the bag of gold weighed him down, and he realized he couldn't swim with it. I just kind of sat at the docks, so I just kind of. And he had to spend like, all day, like, diving, getting a couple coins, getting back, putting them in a the box. So and the Zazelon or a Zazelon wit just high five and whoa! This is fucking awesome! As Aislinn high five so hard, your arm is now broken. <laughs> <laughs> Never high five the barbarian. <laughs> Damn, in your, in like your tribe, if someone walked away from a high five without a, bl without a shattered hand, then it wasn't done right. <laughs> Lucky, I'm here to patch you up, right? We have the same word for thunderclap as we do high five. <laughs> thunderclap! <laughs> So Morgan's just standing at the dogs, just kind of like, I the, the word don't know what this is, is technically translates as little high five. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not lethal high five. Look what no, we <laughs> got! This thing's fucking awesome! Yep. Look, it's called the Green Dragon! It is that what it's called now? We it? totally stole this from a it, dragon! It, well, no, it was <laughs> called the Null, uh, but it was called the Moldy Dragon. <laughs> oh, right, yes, was, it's the Moldy Dragon, my bad. I was just wondering if you changed the name is, <laughs> again. Well, it's green Sorry. and kind of fuzzy. Yeah. <laughs> it is green and kind of fuzzy. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like it might have been stored somewhere, like, dark <laughs> and sort of damp for a long time. <laughs> Is it, is like it a sewer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was the sewer, but yeah. <laughs> just don't prick your hand on any nails. <laughs> you don't have to do any work. Just what we're gonna have soon. Hey, can you make me a telescope? We should. Um, we should buy can, can some you, mundane can, items. Can you, can well, I can buy it. Like a mundane. <laughs> I can. Yeah. No. no. Uh, so <laughs> yes. Wait. Wait. Can you get like prestigious ties one or something? I can pull no. it out of my cloak of useful items. He can but make, it's, it's a mundane He can make that mundane thing that are crappy quality. Telescope is not an object of crappy quality. Telescope, okay, 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 telescope <laughs> and we probably need some sort of compass. I have an iPad. The ship actually has a compass. That's not oh, okay. my job. <laughs> I'm up the Does navigator. Does anybody know how to navigate a ship? <laughs> There's, no. We have a book. I do. <laughs> The book tells us what to do! We have, we have, we have a ritual book for not to I inspect what to the do. bowels of the ship and then come out on deck. <laughs> we, have, we, have, we, have a, we have a book that uh, has multiple okay. rituals to I'm curious, you well, asked me why I'm wearing an eye patch. I thought the uh, bandana would be more uh, confusing to you. I'm gonna eye patch, bandana. 
sash around the waist. Parrot, Cigar. Parrot. You've acquired a vest somewhere. <laughs> I now have unlimited ammo, but no gun. And a oh. cutlass. <laughs> Which he has to in his chest. It's like, you've acquired a cutlass, you just store the hole in your torso. Yes. How, how is the... Uh, are you still doing the magic missile through your chest thing? Yeah, I still got that. It doesn't that hurt? You, you need to take the skin off your phone. You should probably get If it purchased shit. for more than four hours, you need to go speak with your doctor. I'm gonna change my armor's color to look like I have bandoliers and like a captain's pirate outfit. Do you have magic armor? Or yes, are I you do. just dressing differently? No, I have magic armor. Okay, either way you can, yep. Yeah. Yes. Oh, jealous. Bandoliers of what? Bandoliers of. Uh, do you of have drugs? <laughs> bandoliers of. That's. Vials. Uh, you got two hip holsters, you've got flasks, and you have a bandolier of shot glasses. <laughs> no, no, it's, it's actually... He is the Jägermeister. No, 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 it's actually, it's actually Grave does. It just, I have a straw. I have a straw. I think you probably run out of that stuff. No, no, no. you put all the Grave dust actually, in the Actually, I haven't been tired of using it, so I've actually kept it. Oh, fuck. I forgot to write it down. I think I have three charges left. Not that many. Anyway. In any case, I now have a tricorn hat as well. <laughs> From somewhere. Like a pirate hat. Yeah, it's a tricorn hat. More it has, it has no lots of stuff on the front of it. It's just like the sea sickness yes. is just like, this is just ridiculous. <laughs> Alright, now that we're here, yeah. let's go to the island. There, there, is, there is like a little compass mounted next to the ship's <laughs> building. <laughs> I'm not the man with the arms, I'm going to take care of that. Along with the sectum. Yeah, yeah, I'm actually just going to take the telescope on it somewhere. You seem to be enjoying it with no I take it. So it's firmly actually I have drink it <laughs> somewhere. Yeah. It's probably in the crow's so nest and basically mounted on something. I definitely take my it. flail out enemies. and break it off. <laughs> you destroy the delicate lens work, you twit. <laughs> and I take the telescope. And it's it yeah. emits a very loud crunching sound when you try to fold it. <laughs> Evidently this was not a folding telescope. <laughs> What? I back my cloak, pull on oh. one, go fold this one. Again. So yeah, the perfectly functioning telescope is coming from the mask, <laughs> and for no reason you decided to break it. <laughs> Do you know how expensive that was? <laughs> don't worry, it'll regrow when we change the boat back. <laughs> you don't know that? The rest of the things in the boat didn't. <laughs> oh no. Uh, Gouji needs to come on board too, guys. That's fine. Uh, Permission for the death machine to come on board. Is he outstrength? No. <laughs> how well does, how well does he how well does he interact with skeletons? Uh, he still has a breath weapon that immobilizes and a power called trample. <laughs> Welcome aboard! <laughs> he immediately he can breaks swab the, the poop off. deck when he makes a mess on it. Falls he, does, the he sort of walks up on deck and does fall through a section of fighting to the deck below. I, I think he's in the whole thing. There's then a pause. <laughs> There's another crash as he falls through another session. <laughs> he has now a skeleton permanently attached to his back. <laughs> Old habits. Just <laughs> grabs, grabs the sailors and puts it on his back. But the skeleton's kind of fine with it. The but there's, no more, there's no more pokies on it, though. The skeletons start repairing the hole, and a couple of skeletons start dedicating themselves to just putting planks in front of him as he walks <laughs> to reinforce the floor. Yeah, just, just, just stay where you are. <laughs> stay in a, yeah. I quietly think, good job, guys. <laughs> Who's controlling the skeletons? His hat. The guy <laughs> is the captain of the ship, and I'm his first mate. <laughs> the guy who least never trust to do it. Yeah. So that's how they do it in the Feywild. You're all my do first I? mates. <laughs> so I guess we're nobody's sleeping on the ship. Right, your first mate, your best mate, your good mates. <laughs> <laughs> your token female mate. <laughs> Oh, what are two of these skeletons? <laughs> First lady of the ship. <laughs> there, are, there are female skeletons on here. How would you if be you, able to tell? Uh, the shape of the hip bone. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Anyway. Then they walk around. <laughs> Just like... The way they're walking around. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> they walk like the girls in a GTA game. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Okay. Let's just steer the ship into Riddlet Bay. <laughs> and we're off. Here, so you guys are heading off then? Yes. yes. As, As we say, sail away, I go, I go, first mate, transform the boat back to its original condition. 
I would say uh, the condition it's currently in, the double masted this spinner is shape, is basically shaped like a blockade runner, which is one of the fastest forms for a boat to be. So if you're in a hurry, it's not a bad idea to keep it in that. Leave it as it is! <laughs> it looks like the way it was shaped before was like a pleasure yacht, basically. Oh. Like it just had a big open deck for lounging around. I thought it would be more like the Black Pearl, <laughs> which is more like the three mast. Yeah, yeah, fuck you yeah. up kind of ship. Oh, like the Galleon kind of ship? Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, yeah, this is more like the Interceptor. One of those. Yeah, it does actually look a lot like the Interceptor. It's the same, similar kind of boat. Uh, Sir, what do you say? Check the book to see if it has one of those shapes. Uh, yeah, I checked the book to see if it has a black pearl shape. <laughs> <laughs> it has, you can it turn it, you can make it look like a ship, ship like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think that was just a galleon. <laughs> yeah. it, like, look, oh, look, it says black pearl shape right here. Let's go. Oh. You do notice one other thing about the, uh, <coughs> oh, here. Which is that a number of the rituals look mm -hmm. like they're, like they have modifications in them mm -hmm. that don't really make sense to you immediately because mm -hmm. they're not part of the spell. Yeah. You eventually work out what they are as they're tied into his hat, mm -hmm. oh. such that if you're wearing said hat and are aware of how to cast rituals, you can basically cast them out of the book for free. Mm -hmm. Cool. Mm -hmm. Do you yeah. should be, Although only, be if, you, the only if you know how to wear cast rituals. <laughs> I, think, I, think, I think he should He's be wearing the hat He's not going to give up then. the hat, no. but he can't he, cast spells. He, he, no. he can still cast them out of the book. Yeah, but it has a cost. <laughs> yep. We'll be saving what is the cost? The uh, rituals have component costs. But yeah. All right. There's probably they're, some components on the somewhere. They're on the I ship. It's fine. Probably There's in the box in the book. Game. The other thing. Yeah. The other thing I wanted to tell you before you come out was a... The house where you raided, mm. there were a number of maps of the Hook Islands, uh, drawings of some kind of step pyramid or temple, Ooh. as well as a nautical navigation chart, uh, basically for the area First of the sea around the islands. The fog spell. That we are totally taking those with us. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> I can't read the I'm gonna some real <laughs> past the Caribbean shit up on this bitch. <laughs> I want to have that fog going like crazy. Sure. Yes, sir, Captain Sir. <laughs> this seems excessive. Bit don't worry, fog. it's for sneaking. We don't need this much fog to sneak. <laughs> We've covered half the city. <laughs> Shh. You want them to not see us leave. Come on. By them, do you mean the port guards? <laughs> yes. yes. Right. Avoid port duties. <laughs> I shudder to ask how, how much girl. time we've pissed away already. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Alright. So I anyway. will give you the chart then, since you seem to be able to navigate the ship. Yes. 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 He's got the navigate. Okay, if you're on the ship, just give it the hat. <laughs> Alright. L to the no. <laughs> Alright, you travel along in your ship. You're making pretty good progress. Based on the navigational charts you can see there, you know what route they were intending to take, so you can follow it without too much difficulty. Oh, as we're sailing, obviously I get the skeletons come up on deck and sail properly. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. The rest of them just doing a small musical. <laughs> you are making good time. Uh, you find that uh, it looks like this, basically this chart that we're following, has deliberately sort of taken them out into deep water a lot. You're not immediately sure why. It's a trap. It might be because their ship just has a deeper hull and that it can't navigate shallower waters. Whereas Maybe. you could, if you wanted to, shapeshift your boat so that it could. Maybe it were a If you did that, you could shave some time. Sure. Save some time for what? Are there, are there big check. animals in the deep? Do I, do I know any, like... Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Krakens, well, Leviathans. So I, 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 yeah, Giant I just like to mention. What about mermaids? We're gonna sail mermaids through gonna be the shallow water. Red. Shallow waters, let's go. Right. Fuck that. <laughs> I'm gonna find me a mermaid. Bouncing your boat back into sort of smaller bit. Alright. So, long as you're going along, you can skip over sort of fairly shallow sections of water. Uh, you do spot another ship, sort of even further into the shallows, that's going the other way. Uh, Walter, you can roll me a history check. Alright, 18 plus uh, 19, that's 30. probably enough. 37. Right. <coughs> Your knowledge of naval history and uh, all matters nautical, apparently. <laughs> apparently. Which has now apparently become a thing. He's, he's the truest mariner. Uh, you recognize this ship. It is, the sh it is a ship called the Storm's Pride. Mm -hmm. It is an outlaw ship. Mm -hmm. It is used by a group of drug runners. Alright, how well armed are they normally? 
Very good question. Uh, you see, I just like I massive like cannons to go on the side of it. Normally, they're well armed. They have a well armed crew. Mm -hmm. However, their ship is would not be difficult to destroy. It might be difficult to hit. Mm -hmm. It is basically unlike a lot of ships that navigate this area. Yeah. It has a flat keel, which is right. really bad if you're in open water. Mm -hmm. But what it does mean is you can ride in really, really shallow water that other boats can't follow you. Right. So it looks like that's mainly the way they get around patrol boats. <coughs> As a captain, I, I am democratic, so I'll put this up to a vote. <laughs> I would like to raid this ship for and drugs. plunder their loot booty. <laughs> but we don't need drugs. And how are we you going to sell them? Sell them to the watch. You also have no idea. Sell but you also what? <laughs> as evidence. <laughs> The watch I... don't buy evidence. Yeah, <laughs> the more authorities do. They I, 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 no, I hate to tell you this, but I don't think that's how the authorities work. It. I don't think that's how policing works. Our, our, our friends of the court authorities. I don't feel comfortable stealing these guys. Well, we could just steal it and dump it and take all their gold because they obviously do have it because they're drug runners. Yeah, well, my brother's getting beaten up real quick, so I think we should hurry. Well, are they bad guys? Yes, they're drug runners. From what you know of them, mm -hmm. they don't really have a history of fighting with people. They, they mostly away. try to run away anytime someone starts a fight with them. Mm -hmm. uh, if they get pinned somewhere in cornered, they tend to fling fire at people. Yeah, As after my first mate informs <laughs> me of this, I go, I vote against my plan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, basically, if you back them into the corner, they'll try and kill you. But other than that, they try they'll to run away. Uh, let's just sail real close. They got a schedule to guys. Kill. Let's just sail real close. <laughs> And have the skeletons <laughs> sing a spooky sea chanty. And you friend them. them. You do they notice that help. the ship is tacking away from yours further into shallow water. <laughs> <laughs> it might have something. They can see your boat. Your boat's bigger than theirs. There's fog. Yes, there's fog that has like bass in it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And I, skeleton I, blowy eyes. The fog <laughs> makes it harder to see, but when you're drug runners, you tend to be keeping a lookout for other ships. What's okay, the international okay. pirate symbol for we're willing to help you? No, no, no. Since, since, they, since they do see us. Wait. Since they do see us. You just take your pirate symbol. Yes, yeah, yeah, so let's help the drug runners. <laughs> right. that's, that's all I want. The ship seems to be, their ship's is tacking further towards shallower water, <laughs> which you know is actually kind of dangerous. <laughs> They're sort of pushing it. <laughs> Evidently, they don't want to go near the ghost ship. Captain, I, I recommend we've scared them enough. I think it's time we just left them alone. No, no we keep sailing. No, no, that's fine. No, no, they're floating. It's just the fire and it's we're, we're, we're seeing the sea shanty. Huh? Is there some way to make like the ship temporarily invisible? Yeah, and then we just sail away. I think we should get going, guys. No, we're, no, we're going. It's just, I just told myself. What about to make, make it emit an eerie green glow? <laughs> yes. Oh, you like a ghost ship? You can make, make the ship emit light. Yeah, right. yeah. Yeah, all right. No, no, we have the fog. That's enough. Well, yeah. it's creepy, like, fog, and then the and then like, tired skeleton ship sea. glowy and but the skeleton. How do skeletons sing in the first place? That's creepy enough. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I pressed a different tongue. <laughs> None of these that they have. They just kind of do this like a bone violin, I guess. Yeah. It's, it's, no, no, like, like xylophone. <laughs> and it just takes it out. Yeah, exactly. So like one, one of the really so like small. fat skeletons turns out he really was just big boned. His sounds like a steel drum when he plays it. <laughs> Rather than a spooky tune, it sounds like a Caribbean up yeah, kind of it's, tune. Yeah, it's, it's a happy Caribbean. We're on a board of cruise. We're on a Caribbean cruise. Like, well, let's pass them. They're obviously, you know, minding their own lawful business. Legitimate <laughs> businessman. And we have places to go. Okay, um, uh, can I? Uh, let's just mark down that route. Let's just mark down that route. Yeah, we'll come back later. No, no we're marking down that route to get to. Uh, and such. Well, the, that wouldn't be the watch's job. That would be the port authority's job. <laughs> to, give, to give to the corrupt port authority who do we know. Why are they corrupt? Now, they probably already Why? Know. Well, they take bribes. <laughs> they help him dispose of a body. <laughs> they help him dispose of a dead body. <laughs> <laughs> well. It's a story I don't like to talk about. <laughs> Why? It all started in. The, the main, bad. The main reason, reason why they're a lot more corrupt is because Songs the loot. standards for hiring in the Port Authority <laughs> are just lower than the Watch. <laughs> so the Port Authority tends to be so built entirely of people who wanted to get into the Watch, but couldn't <sighs> for either failures of morality, <laughs> psychology, or skill. <laughs> Criminal records. Criminal, Criminal records. records. <laughs> Psych records. Oh boy. They actually don't let you in the Port Authority if you have a criminal record. <laughs> well, unless you pay the right person. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> the problem is basically, it's just sort of been allowed to fester <laughs> over the years of them yeah. getting wor the worst, the throwback recruits every time, who eventually end up getting promoted, and then hiring even worse people. <laughs> they bring their corrupt family members in. <laughs> Cronyism, you know? Cronyism. Yep. Oh, boy. Back yep. to the job. As you're continuing along, uh, you know of a couple other pirate crews who operate in this area. Mm -hmm. You know of a ship called the Blue Raven, mm -hmm. which is a very large ship which has a massive battering ram on the front of it. Mm -hmm. It favors ramming into ships, boarding and overwhelming its crew. Yeah. <coughs> and you know of a ship called the Bastion, mm -hmm. which is an absolutely massive galleon bristling with weapons, <laughs> <laughs> which actually prefers to sink. Mm -hmm. ships, and then basically just dive for the cargo after, oh, all right. and just let all the crew on the ground. <laughs> all right. They're not the friendliest bunch. <laughs> uh, you also know of one other group, which is the Widow Cutter, mm -hmm. which is... <laughs> Thank you, that is the greatest name for a pirate ship in the world. <laughs> yep. This one is a two-masted schooner. It's very fast, and it is actually crewed by a loth worshipping drow. Ooh. Whose favorite thing to do is fling mast breaking ballista rounds yeah. to disable a ship, then circle it and shoot the crew with sleep bolts, then kidnap them and sacrifice them. Oh. <laughs> Charming uh, jets. Uh, uh, guys? Do you, do you have to You're thinking what I'm thinking, buddy? Personal vendetta? <laughs> yeah. That's, that's gonna happen. Just saying. If we run into if we run into him, it's gonna happen. Like, I'm I'm sorry, but we're gonna have to stop. <laughs> and and no. and murder. You know, ignore the, the drug smugglers. No, no but they, they they make some people happy. <laughs> Consenting you know? adults, right? Consenting adults. <laughs> These drow make nobody happy. No, they don't. And they must die horrible, horrible deaths. You do know also that um, one of the Hook Islands which from the maps that she brought over yeah. appears to be where they're trying to go. Really it's called Witchwalker Island. Mm -hmm. It's not racism. It is actually has a very high drought population. Yeah. Oh, Most really? of them do racism? not worship lol. Uh, yeah. yeah. A nearby island near them, called <laughs> Silver Spire Island, uh, is where the lol cultists tend to hang out, and they're generally a massive <clears throat> pest and living hell for the people on Witchwalker. All right. Oh. Their general policy is to shoot at drought who come near their ship. Drow they don't recognize who come near their port. <laughs> What's the second one? <laughs> they might be good drow. We gotta deal with that. <laughs> they do it? tend to inspect drow who come into the port very What's carefully. What's a good term for a, like a derogatory term for drow? I'm trying to think of something with spider. Drow? Darky, silver hair. Uh, I'm trying to think of something with spider. Um, Darky, white hair, spider sucker. Lots of them. Spider sucker. Whipped, ruled spider by spider women. Sucker. I can go on for hours about this. Spy is ruled by women a derogatory term. Well, think about all the other kingdoms in the set. <laughs> yeah, but the drow wouldn't view that as derogatory. They'd be like, yeah, that, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> well, a that lot of places people are stupid. That is a true statement. <laughs> the fact the statement is stupid makes it a valid insult. <laughs> I'm gonna call them a bunch of dirty spider suckers. That's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, aren't you? What are you again? I am drow. He's a drow, but he's he doesn't drow, worship Walt. Yeah. I do not worship Walt. I worship Corlog, mm -hmm. god of all elves. <laughs> so you, you, you. God of all you're elves, like an including elf the black sheep of that group. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So, so you're like an uncle Legolas. Yes. <laughs> sure. With with questionable moral ethics sometimes. Questionable. <laughs> you're downright wrong. <laughs> Hey, I try to keep a cool There's no gray area. There are there's sometimes, sometimes, I do them with good intentions. As you're uh, continuing on in your travels, it's sometimes. moving into sort of dusk, the sun setting over the water as you continue to move along. Is that the... You're sort of forced to move a bit more out into open water because you can't really navigate shallows in the dark. It's just dangerous. Mm -hmm. You've got dark vision, so you might be able to do it with some Do skill. it. Light activate. <laughs> Actually, I, I do have a little. light spell, so I can... Actually, light no, spell no. normally only illuminates light. No, even, even, even <coughs> better. Even better. I cast Ember Eyes and stand at the bow of the ship. <laughs> it's like <laughs> looking creepy. <laughs> yeah. wah, and I go, blah. Blah. Uh, <laughs> like the Inception music. <laughs> you can only have I think it was imitating a song for it. Thank you. Yeah, you got it. 21. <laughs> you see ahead of you, a ways in the open water, there is a ship. It's not moving, though. It's fairly big. Rise off. Okay. Sneak mode on. 
Skeletons. We should investigate. Sneak up on that ship. And walk on the water and across to the ship? No, slow. Slow. sneak. We have to be careful. We might startle them. I mean, this place has skeletons on it. I mean, you are riding in what is basically a ghost ship. Yeah. (laughs) I mean, if there's anybody there alive, they're probably pissing themselves watching this. On the upshot, if you sail around enough and don't interact with people, you will eventually become a ghost story. (laughs) (laughs) That's that's, that's really what I'm talking about. Yeah. That's not interesting. <laughs> yeah. But they might need our help. We have to stop. No, no, okay. No, we'll have the ghost ship, like skeletons, keep circling around. We're going to hop off and we're going to go towards the ship. Summon the lifeboat. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So we, we, we all hop off into the lifeboat and we go, skeletons, keep looping around until I call you back. Hmm? I named the lifeboat Bitter, Bigger Fish. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Naval knowledge, would looping around like that could be considered an aggressive action. Circling the ship? Yes. No, not cir- No, don't circle the ship. Just like, is there a naval movement that isn't viewed as aggressive? Hailing. Hailing. How's that done? Basically by sending up a flag or a flare and waving and yelling at them and saying, Hey, we're harmless. We do. We only have one flag. It's black. With like a usually, usually, it's, <laughs> usually, it's, usually it's done by signaling with flag signal. Okay. okay. Actually, but you I, cast your night spell and just like, I wave it around. No, 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 yeah. no, no. Go ship. Sail around the back of the island. I'll call you back later. Just, just, go, just go out of sight. Just go hide. hide. Go hide. <clears throat> Call you back later. You guys are getting in a lifeboat though, and yeah. letting yeah. see your ship yeah. sort of go up. We go. All right. Hey. No, but no, but no, but we hide, like, so that we don't seem like we're part of that ghost ship. As you go to uh, summon the lifeboat, the <laughs> try to get this ghost ship to rattle off and cast the spell. The design on the side of the ship that's sort of painted along it it's, has like a pair of dragons entwining around a shield crest. <laughs> mm-hmm. uh, the shield crest goes pop, and then it drops off sideways oh. and becomes a boat. All right. Oh! Yeah! Let's do it. Nice. Uh, I leave Gauji on the ghost ship. <laughs> Unless he goes, like, he can just go underwater and just. Manning his silent vigil. <laughs> we need to make him look cuter somehow. I Give him little I anime know. eyes. <laughs> yeah, little no, on him. Big googly eyes. <laughs> I was about to say, just stick a googly eyes on him and just paint like a smile. Like this big each. <laughs> Futurama. The big, there's a lot of them. No, the big one, the, the beat up, beat up bender in like the robot fighting. <laughs> Several. Oh, of them. destructor. Destructor. Like those, <laughs> yeah, those control. Oh yeah, from the master. I was thinking the crushing air is one time. Oh, that's what I'm. That's what I'm imagining for the robot that she has now. What like, kind of condition is the boat in? Hmm? What condition is this boat in? Yours or theirs? Theirs. Theirs. Uh, as you move closer to it, you can see it looks like it was damaged pretty badly. Oh. The reason it's not moving is because the mast's broken. Oh. Which is usually a pretty good way of rendering a ship dead in the water. Yeah. Uh, you don't Maybe see any, who do we know you don't see any signs of crew that. on board. Mm-hmm. Pretty wonder. much anyone in a naval battle who has a ca- ca- who uh, catapult has a will do that. Tendency to yeah. do that. This yeah. is similar to stabbing a dude. Everybody does it. Yeah. Yeah. But more so a tendency of the ships we just listed. Mm-hmm. You mean all of them? Yeah. No. I, I will say. The Widow Cutter is known for doing that, but every ship does that. I hope it's the main reason they're known for doing that. What they're mostly known for doing is doing that, then circling around the ship and peppering with arrows is more their call mark. You don't see any arrows peppering the sides of this thing. Oh, it looks like they need our help. Any yeah. signs of cannon damage? Uh, no, because cannons don't exist, but. Okay. Uh, there are. No, there's not really signs of siege weapon damage other than the broken mast. Okay. And are you guys volunteering to row? Because as a good captain, I will help row. Do you want to just bring the skeleton along to row? No. No. <laughs> no I specifically stop him from doing that. No, because he would. You. No, I don't. No, I don't. I'm, again, I want to keep the ghost story alive. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. That's the whole thing. Oh, bro. Jeez. Right. Yeah, we've rolled all the way out here in a tiny uh, like boat. Yeah. No, so keep him out. Not the I'm standing at the stern, you know, with the big... Wait, Flash like blading, a, uh, at them. Yeah. Trying to make like blinking. Yeah. Well, if you're using a light spell, you can make a blink on and off pretty yeah. easily. <laughs> yeah, I, bl- I try to blink in Morse code. Yep. I try to say. I was gonna say you probably do two of them and do a semaphore because that would be more standard. But yeah. I, I try to call up to the Morse ship code to also get a response. Works. Nope. There also aren't any lights on. Oh. Okay. Oh, looks like they're not signaling back. All, All right. right. You don't see anyone moving. Okay, everyone, quiet now. All right, we I turn off the light and try to sneak on board. Right. I throw my grappling hook on board. Roll up to the side of the boat. It is a 
good solid wall of wood to get up to the deck. Grab a hook. Grab a hook? Sure. You I teleport out. Yeah, you got a new silent one. <laughs> Alright. Waldo arrives first as you emerge on deck. You can see, well, there's blood on this deck. No. Mm. A fair bit of it. Mm -hmm. Second thing you notice is you don't see any bodies around here. Uh -oh. But you do see that the mask is uh, burnt. I need to like, teleport up. It looks like it wasn't see. destroyed with you can just like climb catapult up fire. It was destroyed with some kind I, of. I would suck it and fall off. Like <laughs> fireballs, acid <laughs> bolts, things like that. All right. I mean, there are also several marks on the deck, scorched. Looks like there was some kind of magical fight that took place here. Okay, uh, like marks says in not uh, marks not. isn't like fire acid, but looks like sort of weird warping of the wood. Like there's a part where a section of the deck <laughs> appears to have warped into a group of vines that were maybe. Okay, so something. nothing like lettering or anything like Did that. Did you no. see any wor like worms? Hmm? The worms from that worm creature of oh. the red cloaks. Mm, no. Although you don't know why they would hang around. Just making sure. Summon my... I'm going to uh, go to... You can find some uh, find blood it. on the railings. It looks like mm -hmm. whoever died on here, they were probably just thrown overboard. Oh. I'm going to plunder the okay. ship. Go right. to the captain's quarters. Heading down into the... Uh, as you go into the captain's quarters, the first thing you notice is a statue. Hmm. There is a man with a cutlass in each hand like this, who is Alice. currently a stone statue. Uh, the door. Buddy, I, I he has a hole in his chest, so it looks like he was that's a statue. Yeah, have I you, think that's. Have, have you updated us on what Alice can do? Okay. Yeah. Tisk, tisk, Alice. It, it, it's either Alice or one of her family members, probably. Yeah. 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 Now, at this point, Waldo, mm -hmm. uh, you actually realize you recognize this ship. Mm -hmm. It was hard to do so before just from the damage, but looking at the front of it, you can see that there used to be a bowsprit ram here. It mm -hmm. looks like it was broken off. This is the Blue Raven. Okay. It's a pirate ship. The one that rams into people and tries to board them. Oh, okay. yeah. I loot the room. It looks like they probably tried to attack the Gravel Stroke ship and it didn't go well for them. <laughs> Ugly. <laughs> However, I, I'm concerned by the fact that the captain's in the captain room with a seemingly reactionary or defensive position in stone. Like, you think he would have been on deck nope. or something? Nope. Nope. Captains can be wusses. You can hide in the captain's quarters. Depends on the captain. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. I'm not one of those captains. It's also possible that <clears throat> they rammed into the gravel stroke ship, attacked, then got attacked with volleys of <clears throat> magical fire, and he retreated to hide in his room. Okay. Mm -hmm. I pulled uh, the statue's eye. It's a statue. It has no, it, you, you did not hurt its feelings. <laughs> 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 Falls over, it breaks. <laughs> Do we know how long ago this all happened? Like from the blood, for example? Uh, from the blood and from the heat coming off some of the smoldering bits, you would say probably sometime late yesterday? Mm. Or early this point? Yesterday blood. It does like yesterday blood. <laughs> You're just looking a little bit too much like, yeah. <laughs> Alistair's like, no, no. Yesterday was a few hours of the day before. <laughs> Thanks, Alistair. <laughs> New power. <laughs> Resident blood expert. Are you actually tasting blood? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Just looking at that. You actually don't hear anything from Alistair about it. Which is odd. <laughs> However, you have contracted HIV. <laughs> As a vampire, I'm a mute. You're not a vampire. <laughs> As my vampire aspect, I'm a mute. <laughs> Only one you're in the aspect. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It just suppresses the symptoms. <laughs> you're still contagious, though. <laughs> anyway, uh, looking around the rest of the ship, you do find a couple other statues. No. Uh, some of them are sort of toppled over and broken. <laughs> All of them are armed in various states <laughs> of like fighting. Okay. However, there are a couple of them that look like they might have been asleep or disarmed and going. Ah. At the time they got stabbed. Do they have any gold on them? That stone? Mm, some. <sighs> I put it in the box. At the to pay for rituals. I just sort of chip the gold off. <laughs> That's fine. There's a little stone pouch on the side where you just kind of chip it off. <laughs> Does it return to like non stone? Was it no. Like, no. <laughs> Is the gold petrified? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Damn it. It does well. <laughs> this is perfectly worthless now. No, no. Least. Keep it until we find Alice and get her to turn it back. <laughs> She's not exactly like our best bud, you know? No. <laughs> is there anything in there about removing petrification? 
Uh, or to, well, to, 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 do any of these two no. know anything about removing the debris? Do I know anything? Do you have any rituals? There are rituals to do that, but there aren't any in the book you have, so oh. unless you have one. You know what? Whatever. <laughs> I, put, any... I put any loot we find into the box of magic. <laughs> you don't find much. <laughs> You find a lot of stone coins. <laughs> I think, I think, I think the real journal? folks probably have the money. You find a lot of stone coins and a bent telescope. <laughs> <laughs> In fact, it looks like someone just took it perfectly intact and then went dunk on a railing. <laughs> just deliberately ruin it. <laughs> it's like some kind of asshole. Some kind of asshole. I, as, like, as I hold it, I fall to my knees and you know, growl, <laughs> We will never find you. <laughs> This is now my jamming goal. <laughs> oh. <laughs> to forever deny you a telescope for no reason. <laughs> for no, no reason. reason. Uh, the captain's journal. Captain's journal. Doesn't work. There isn't one? Nope. Mm. A lot of pirates aren't known for literacy. <laughs> I'm gonna look for a uh, secret compartment. You find a section of sail that someone tore off and wrote a captain logging thing. <laughs> Today, good day. Kill many people. <laughs> he decided to start one of these. <laughs> Started sail journal. Does he have one of those um, recording quartz crystals? Beef, <laughs> beef, mad fist. <laughs> Pirate extra, extra d dude. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Uh, secret compartments, perhaps. Mm -hmm. Perception check. No, no, no. He, naval, naval knowledge. Is there, be, is there an equivalent of a Damn black it. box? There's no standard place for a smuggling hatch. That would be stupid. <laughs> yeah, that would be very stupid. Well, on the Firefly class ship, <laughs> there are many nooks and crannies that <laughs> 15. I think? Nope. Don't find it. Uh, can I? Yeah, you can go for it. Yeah. 19. Mm -hmm. Okay, I took 10. Um, 23. Nice. Yeah, I'll go for 22. 12. Nope. None of you find anything. Damn it. Mm. Um, is there like some sort of equivalent of a black box? Like a recording crystal? No. Mm. Not on a pirate. Why would you record what you're doing on a pirate ship? Maybe they're practicing for their musical That's Just in case we're arrested, we want to make sure there's lots of evidence. <laughs> <laughs> I go like to the like captain's quarters <laughs> and just enter my mindscape just trying to find Alistair. Sure. Shut up. Alistair. Mm. Right. What? Dude, you missed me eating blood. I did not. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Dude, whenever the vampires actually sleep. Yeah, I don't know. This is weird. No, no, it's not even when do vampires sleep, it's when do the souls of vampires in my mind sleep. Yeah, that's, that's also happened. a good point. I can't believe I missed that. Why were you sleeping? Sleeping? I wasn't sleeping. Then how'd you miss it? I was trying to find that fire guy. Oh, okay. Where'd he go? I have investigated the matter thoroughly and can state that I have no fucking idea. <laughs> <laughs> hey, did you see this new hat? It's awesome. You just start a poker game. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, the poker game where you just, ah, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> no, he's actually quite rational around now, that's there. <laughs> he doesn't yell at him. He yells in between plays, yeah. <laughs> Surprisingly, it makes him very hard to read. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, they're playing blackjack. I'll split that. <laughs> <laughs> you can do something. He's like the right down <laughs> They didn't even talk to the thing. <laughs> she just sort of points at it. <laughs> Shaggy. Alright. Okay. I got it. Uh, at the captain's quarters, mm -hmm. I'm going to like trace my hand and see if I can find any sort of magic things on the walls or desks or something. Oh, detect magic. See if you can connect with the wood, because you are wood, technically. Roll into the ship oh, a little really? bit. Really? <laughs> he, he he's a he's, different kind of tree, though. Yep, yeah, he is a tree, so maybe he can... He's a special kind of tree. He's a special kind of tree. Put your hand into the wall and see if you can integrate. <laughs> <laughs> you absorb the entire ship into your being. Oh, falls no. Oh, no. Assume direct control. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Hack that pirate ship! Hack it! <laughs> Wynn just hits it with his axe, like, no, no, no! <laughs> Alright, I might be able to hack into the security of this door. Axe. <laughs> <laughs> you said hack! <laughs> also works. 
Is there any other points of notice on the ship? There's crow's nests. There's a couple of um sort of crossbows that are mounted on like oh good crossbows. Their rear rail. Nope. Yep. They are actually superior crossbows. Woo. They're not magic though. Ow. Are there are there any of those like cannons that are mounted at the front of the boats? This one out in the swords. Oh, there's, there's still no cannons this <laughs> day. That fire I considered adding fireball. cannons, but they use wizards. Wizards, yeah. Well, <laughs> no, no! By which I mean they load wizards into a cannon. <laughs> anyway. They shot their captain at us. <laughs> well, if they're going to shoot a superior officer at us, we'll respond with in kind. No, not me, a torpedo! <laughs> 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 anyway, well, uh, you do not detect any thing. magical hidden things, but you do detect that uh, the pirates' two swords, the stone ones, were probably magical when they were swords. Oh. I carefully chip them off. Sure. Through his wrist. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> yeah, no, I take his arm. No, I, I pop off the wrist. Like, <laughs> carefully. Nice. Yeah, nice. <laughs> Okay, we'll keep those. Why do you care? He's a pirate. He's going to get a hook hand anyways. <laughs> Would you like having your hand chopped off? You're just going to unscrew that he's, part of the stone. <laughs> he's a pirate. <laughs> you, why, you, why are you defending evil people who steal from people? Look, buddy. Uh, evil right people who steal from people. Evil people. Right here. Ahem. <laughs> I'm alright. I've seen some of the things you do. Oh, I've never killed an innocent. Uh, yeah, the little fire lizard family in the desert that did, like, nothing. Killed four of them. Yeah. <laughs> like, two the days whole ago. Oh, that's fair. In <laughs> retrospect, <laughs> this pirate would have stabbed us. That is also true. By boarding their ship and stealing their swords off their hands? Yeah. You do know that this captain was considered fairly vicious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, for the crime of stealing, we, can we, take we cut like off a both his hands, <laughs> and then we go on our merry way. It's worth noting that you are official fools, but you're not sure if that's true or just stories about it. <laughs> like, pretty much pirates always want people to think they're vicious. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, what's the, the magical sword, the ex-magical sword? We find his hidden compartments as his diary. He's a really nice guy, actually. <laughs> he has a family at home, he's trying to, like, support him. It's a two crippled kids. That's why he's doing drug runs, just for the family pack. Well, he's got cancer, by the way. He's, he's, <laughs> he's committing piracy to support the orphanage he runs. <laughs> uh, what about, do they have like any maps or something that they like, you know, yeah, mark maps where the, the area, next yeah. location would be? Oh, any uh, hidden treasure maps? They got maps of the area. Maps? <laughs> yeah, this doesn't look like he's marked anything on it. Any treasure maps. Treasure maps. Any more the words of Moist von Lipfig. Any criminal who can't just remember where they buried a huge stash of loot Aww. doesn't deserve to keep it. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Are there no parrots? No parrots. There's a dead parrot. <laughs> Class at all. Class at all. To the bottom of his cage. <laughs> As a crossbow bolt. <laughs> <laughs> I pick it up. Pull he it probably out. bought it with the crossbow bolt in it. I, I, I tried to return it, but the guy kept saying he was just resting. Yep. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Yeah. Wait. I got it. I got it. I'm going to confer with spirits. Oh, the, the, the parrot? parrot? Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Polly, what a resurrection. <laughs> Polly's well, not going to get one until he answers some questions. But <laughs> <laughs> talking. <laughs> you're gonna always do that, aren't you? Every time there's a parrot, I love that. Ask him where's the treasure? It was one of my friends. He taught his parrot to say photog, and it was the creepiest thing. <laughs> where? Do you know where the captain uh, hides things? Behind his drawer. Behind his drawer? I'm gonna go check. No. Did he say drawer or drawers? <laughs> drawers. Good. Inside his pants. I get a drawer, you sort of pull it out. They're petrified. Pull it out of the thing, you see there's, at the back, there's, looks like there's a, basically just a big leather wad. Looks like it's full of money. Sweet. Also, in the back of that drawer, mm -hmm. there is a box of birdseed. Yeah! Which might have been what the parrot was referring to. Aww. <laughs> Aww. I'll take that too. Cover his body in birdseed. Fuck you. I'm taking you too. We want a resurrection, right? Yep. Yeah. No, Do we no, have any resurrection no, no. rolls with us? Probably not. Probably not. And yes. they're they're expensive. It's a good plan. <laughs> There's a spell in the uh, book for raising skeletal creatures. Yes. No. Please. No. no yes. Do you please. want a skeleton no. parrot? I I want a skeleton parrot. 
For, to go with your hat, right? To go with my hat. To go with oh, your hat. Does, does, skeleton wait, parent or zombie does, parent? Does Polly does, want to be resurrected no. as a skeleton, though? Because it's kind of disrespectful. If... Would you really want a zombie parrot on your shoulder? They must stink. I, I didn't say zombie. I wanted skeleton. Skeletal. <laughs> skeleton. Those are clean. <clears throat> uh, yeah, ask the parrot. You want to be a skeleton? You want to be a skeleton? No, I'm just going to say, screw you. I'm just going to resurrect it. Oh, you can do that. No, no way. He's going to bring it back to the... I'll just, isn't there a time limit for resurrection? You need a body there is, but it's pretty generous. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think you even for basic grace dead, that's I think it's like a bug. You probably it's, have it's a preservation. Do you have a preservation ritual? Oh yeah, you got one for preserving dead bodies. Got that in spades. Oh yeah. 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 The bolt actually. I'll preserve the dead parrot. Alright. Make it like a little... um. Were those a Texas Derby? You now have a dead Calypso parent. <laughs> Good job. I think. I think. So how much gold did I get? Hmm. Ask him if there's more gold, like more not bird seed, but like this stuff. Are there more of this stuff on the ship? <laughs> Where did the captain? It's surprisingly bury? easy for a parrot to make the. Oh. Nice. <laughs> Where did the captain bury his treasure? So you, no, you don't get a skeletal parrot. That's fine. That's fine. Yet. Yeah, it's good until he steals it in the night. You can, you can shoot a seagull or like an albatross and then resurrect it as not, a skeleton. You do not shoot, shoot albatrosses. albatrosses. <laughs> shoot albatrosses. <laughs> albatross! <laughs> and all of my albatross! <laughs> what happened here? Watch. Back. Went to catch the people. They shot us. One of them was being kind of crossbow shot. Not Polly. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Sh ship's fully looted. He's got the parrot. Let's head up. Yeah. Uh huh? Yeah. I go, come back to me, go ship of awesomeness. <laughs> the moldy. I'm really tempted to have it not come back. <laughs> <laughs> they just ship. sailed on all the way. <laughs> They're just sailing in a straight line the way it's up. Or think a different ghost ship comes on and then you call. Until they get the Caribbean to go have a vacation. <laughs> no, 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 wait, no. The carriage man shows up in his own ship. Gustav? <laughs> <laughs> the whale stuck to the Gustav. 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 It just shows up the a whale surfaces and has a carriage just parked on it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a boat being towed by a whale. <laughs> Sorry, man, not you. <laughs> it was our own ship, it's nope. fine. No. Right, the uh, ship does come back over. It takes a little while for it to come back. It would have been off time. I'm guessing you hop back on. Yeah. It's gotten full on into dark now. Carrying on as you sail along for a few more hours. Uh, the moon's waxing, but not full. It's pretty big, though. You can see sort of well. Do we still have that fall? Okay, um, I'm going to say, I'm going to tell the skeleton crew to keep us on course, but going slow enough so we can all rest. Okay. And to wake me up if, any, if, if there are any ships nearby. Mm, you're not sure they really recognize things. Like, they're fairly mindless. Okay. They might not make good look at We're just taking shifts. <laughs> okay, keep, it, keep it on course. Mm -hmm. We're gonna take shifts. I'll take first watch. No. Okay. No, you don't take watch. We watch you. <laughs> and yeah. the coast. This yeah. has been established. <laughs> Can Gouji keep watch? I'm not gonna trust you. <laughs> Actually, that is a good Can word. I set Gouji as, like, an alarm clock? Hey, lock me in the tavern for us. Just yes. hold the door. <laughs> No, no. He, this, has, this a, he has a snooze book. Aww. Just have Gouji hold on to him. <laughs> oh, yeah. Then, I can't sleep like that. <laughs> you can sleep with him just sort of holding you. Oh, yeah, okay. Like, yeah, she, she, took the spikes, yeah, like, okay. she took the spikes off of him. So if you just sit down and just hold me down? Okay. So he just sits there and goes... Mm. Good. <laughs> yeah. No, wait, 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 wait. He's it's, spooning with him. Yeah, no, it's a nice hug. Yeah. <laughs> it's, a nice, it's a nice hug on It's a bit of a hug. <laughs> It's still Gouchy's warm. eyes keep blinking 12 o'clock. <laughs> from the it's, previous source. I haven't figured out how to reset it. <laughs> it's still warm from the blood. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. No, <laughs> I, I cleaned it pretty good. It's been cleaned. <laughs> I commissioned someone to clean it. So while watching him, mm -hmm. does he go weird again? <laughs> I, love, I love that me sleeping is a plot device. <laughs> <laughs> I guess so every time night rolls around, it's a little adventure. <laughs> yeah, I guess I'll take first watch this time. Um, uh, I kind of um, want to. Before I go to sleep, make sure we have someone on watch with him at the same time. He kind, of, he kind of got drunk last time. Just saying. Oh. <laughs> You're now critiquing us on our guarding skill. <laughs> yeah, you guys are terrible <coughs> just watching my Be insanity. Before I go to sleep, I go like this and just have my hat and like tuck it underneath. You know, are you going to let him keep wearing that hat while he's asleep? That is I'm not wearing it. I'm holding it. You're still touching it. 
can still not make use well, of it. Put the out. You know what? Fine. I was linked to the spell book. You know what? Fine. Take it off. Hey, wait. Hey, wait. Hold on to this hat. Give it back to me when I wake up. Deal. <laughs> Deal. Never Shut happened. Up. <laughs> <laughs> My hat now. And then all the skills. Field promotion. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's an excellent time to test if the hat actually has any significance or if it's tied to Nofloth. Can I order a skeleton around? Hey, you there. Do it. Uh. Sit down. Dance. Uh, sharpen my axe. What's the hell to do? They're going to be sharpening it on his teeth. Uh, I have a whetstone! <laughs> Looks at the whetstone, goes back to its teeth. <laughs> okay, buddy. There's like a notch grooved into its mouth, apparently it does this a lot. <laughs> it appears to be working fairly well, <laughs> which is disturbing. <laughs> I think Noel off put that skeleton personally. <laughs> Sharpen my hammer. How, yes. Because uh, <laughs> hammer. Do you want to make it more blunt? <laughs> oh, it takes the hammer, hits you with it, <laughs> just bonks you in the head with it for being a dunce. Anyway, does Captain uh, Possessed by Witch do anything? Okay, roll me a perception check. <laughs> 17. Anything going on in my head? 18, 13, Wait, 18. am I sleeping? Uh, 31. <clears throat> well, you're not all awake at the same That's time. That's <laughs> the individual shifts. The Actually, only people I was asking was Wit and Rangro. As, right. as, as soon as the idea of sleeping was mentioned, I went to bed already. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm the same size last time. I'm specifically watching him. Well, what's your roll, sorry? 15. 15? 17. 17? 31. Still not a thing. I thought it was YouTube. Sorry, I'm asleep. Neither of you notice anything out of the ordinary in his behavior. <laughs> besides <laughs> the fact that he's sleeping again. That makes me even more suspicious. Yeah. It should. It should. It should. Like, look, no love. We have a pattern going on. I see it well ruled. No bother. Kill on you. That was a no bother. Since when? We're pretty sure Azazel said that. Yeah, that's just Azazel. It's just a fucking thing. Yeah, it's like, you go. What, 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 what? Do liches sleep? Azazel shall die. Uh, I do they? No, they do not. That even raises even further questions. <laughs> that just raises further questions. <laughs> and with the way dragons are in this setting, do dragons sleep? Yes. 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 Kill all humans. Dragons are fond of sleeping. I think it's God, different. They're, they're kind of like house toilets. They like to sleep <laughs> most of the time. Okay. Mm -hmm. And they're a big pile of treasure. Then go out looting. Brief periods of looting activity followed by nothing. <laughs> Kill all humans. Except street children. Is they will stop talking like that. <laughs> <laughs> nothing odd happens during your watch. Who's taking next one? I guess I... I... Yes, the frail wizard. Go. <laughs> you can always wake With up With high perception. Yes. That's true. I have the, you know... And if yeah. anything happens, just I, I was gonna go say the best the idea is yeah. two and two, so you get tanky with mm -hmm. magic. That seems like a good idea, guys. Yeah, whatever. I do like that you took the two people who have high perception and put them in one group, <laughs> <laughs> and you don't in the other. <laughs> and two. I think you guys. Yeah, should, but you already uh, did you guys that. Be a group, yeah. so you should be a group. Yeah. <laughs> do you, do you I, just I sleep eight hours? No, I'm, uh, I'm uh, I go into trance. Yeah, he trances too. So. Mm. He can actually remain awake for the remainder of the night, basically. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <I'm looking> for, <laughs> when I'm sleeping, do I ever Didn't have a thing where I get, like, don't have to eat if I got enough sunlight or something? Yep. Yeah. You don't have to eat or drink if you're in the sun. I don't think I put it on there, though. I, was want I wanted to see if I had anything about sleeping. Nah. Don't need to sleep. Trees like to sleep. Follow trees. That's more avoiding insanity. It's called, it's called, it's called winter. <laughs> <laughs> winter. <laughs> it's just, yeah. Anyway. Um, so you're coming up? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Next one. All right. Roll me a perception check. Can I just oh. use my 31? Sure. I got a 5 mm. plus 13 is 18. Alright. I'm going to say the 31 you rolled before was actually for something different. Oh, okay. yeah? That was, as you come on deck, you notice immediately, looking around, it's dark, but something doesn't seem right. And heading up to the ship, you see you're off course. Okay. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I put on his hat. 
<laughs> skeletons, right what the? <laughs> what and I going? try to order the skeletons to get us back on course. Yep, they do so. All right, is everything okay? As far as you can tell. Oh, okay. yeah. You're not sure why the ship was going the wrong way. Go back to the phylactery, free my soul. It was actually heading into shallower water. Oh, uh, yeah. These bastards are trying to sink us. <laughs> but you were wearing the hat. This guy was trying to sink us. <laughs> <laughs> you accused him of trying to sink us. <laughs> the part he fell into in fighting. <laughs> <laughs> Killed one another. Again. Can't you see this ship is tearing us all apart? <laughs> it's cursed. The it's mind's cursed. still in place. I even look disturbed. Sorry? Azazel himself looks fine. He's still sleeping. He's not doing anything unusual. Mm -hmm. After you uh, correct your course and you watch for the night, nothing odd happens to your, sh your ship either. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, sorry. No, something does. <laughs> I'm being dumb. Well, <laughs> am I able to smell Roll that perception thing? checks. Ah, Mine is five because it's dark. <laughs> Nineteen plus thirteen. Tw thirty-two. Math is hard. Yeah, thirty-two minus five is twenty-seven. Twenty-six what? minus five. 21. By the way, it's one hour each. You guys have to watch me, so because I sleep for four hours. No, you don't. I transfer. I transfer four hours. You no, you sleep anymore. for eight. Huh? No, you sleep for six. <laughs> <laughs> Although to you it still feels like four. You jerk. <laughs> well, no, the, no, because obviously I know at this point it's not four. Yeah, but even when you wake up, you like you remain aware while you're doing it. It aware. seems like four hours passed. Aware. Yep. <laughs> so he blacks out for two hours. Possibly, except he In doesn't. Like he doesn't notice a skip. No, no, it's it's like a dream. Hey man, maybe you're becoming a human. You're becoming a maybe you're person. becoming a human. <laughs> <laughs> he punches you in the nose somehow. His crib form. He punches you in your mentally in the nose. <laughs> anyway, uh, during you guys' watch, mm. it is still dark out. Mm. It's like not hitting morning yet. Mm. But uh, what you notice is out to deeper water, so the direction away from where the boat was going. Mm -hmm. uh, you do spot a ship that's making a beeline for you. Oh no! What is it? Everybody. It's a two-masted schooner. Oh! <laughs> it's the drow. You're not sure about that. I snap away. From it is making that a very aggressive the, uh, move towards you. That would be the widow part. Charge it! But I, I, I snap away and I go. I smell drow. No, you don't. Oh. <laughs> Aww. They're not in smell range yet. But I'm increase our size. Right, but they're, they're not in range of that yet. Oh, increase our size yeah. will make I, it easier to hit us. Yeah, mm. reduce the size. No, no, we go as big as we can and go ramming speed. That scared the shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I appreciate. activate plan puffer fish. <laughs> are, we, are, we, are we not in fog still? You are in fog. But they're, so so they're they coming now? after the ghost ship. Mm -hmm. Alright. Is anyone going to wake me up? Uh, no, did I tell. Did I, I get a full, um, full night's sleep before? You can treat yourselves as having gotten an extended rest okay. here. Okay. Is anyone going to wake me up? Uh, I think we should wake everyone up. Gauji, can you wake up Al Alistair? <laughs> can you wake yeah. up Azazel? What's going on? He just kind of slammed the hat on head. <laughs> Captain! We got a problem. Give me my hat. We just did. <laughs> it's your What's word. No, I don't. I hold on to my hat. <laughs> right. We are not doing this right now. <laughs> Give uh, him my hat. On the ducks sort of keeping a lookout on them, you still can't really make anything other than just that it's a ship mm -hmm. that's coming towards you. Does anybody have right. a telescope? It's coming closer though. <laughs> no, we don't. I think we've established no, that. We don't have a telescope. <laughs> I can don't... I just pull one out of my coat? Do, uh, like a crummy it, one. Can like it like generate a, one? Um, a crummy thing that's less than 10 gold. Oh, yeah, telescope is not less than 10 gold. <laughs> no. Yes! It gives you like a magnifying glass, it's like, here you go. It's just a big magnifying glass. It's like a thousand gold. Do you have yeah. two? I know, do you have two, 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 two magnifying glasses? I, mean, <laughs> I can see why they made it expensive, because telescopes in that time sort of period were really expensive. Can I fix expensive? the one that was on the magic ship? magic exists. So I mean, come on, you can... A ritual to do There was a telescope. There was a telescope, but it takes me money to fix things, and I don't have that much money on me. And I don't really care what you guys do. Can, can you can you give me two magnifying glasses? No, I pulled. That one totally hand doesn't hand. work. <laughs> That's why it's expensive. But don't you have farsight anyway? Uh, dark. Yeah, dark. Oh, 
you can make out a lot easier what's happening on that boat. You can see people moving around on it. Do Even they look dark people? <laughs> they're short and they're slim, so they could be brown. But, you know, do I see silver streaks? Uh, several of them have long hair, but like, I think dark vision is monochromatic, isn't it? I have no idea. Yeah, I have no idea. Either. It's monochromatic. Yeah. Well, they do have light hair. They could be brown. Uh, it looks like a couple of them. You can see the crow's nests on the two masts each have little crossbow mounts on them. And the front of their ship has what looks like a catapult on it, which is currently being winched back. Oh. Hey guys, uh. let's steal their telescope. <laughs> <laughs> so, ramming way. speed? Ramming speed. Ramming First speed. up, is there any way to hide the mast? No. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. Lower the mainsail! If you do the yeah. shapeshifty thing, you could remove the mast, but then your ship wouldn't move. Well, could we shapeshift it again? No, so no, 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 Sh shapeshift it into a Viking ship. With the thing the, is, with it, the oars. it takes a few minutes for it to do that. Mm -hmm. So you couldn't do it in the middle of a fight, but you could put the mask away right away and then just sit there. Yeah. Okay, well, right. half the skeletons wait, 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 no, so, no, so what but I, From what you know of the Widowcutter's crew, that's not a good tactic. They prefer to target ships that are dead in the water. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, There's their favorite thing is to go around and shoot at them. They yeah. favor artillery. Oh, okay. okay. Mm -hmm. I go... I, 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 I go in my helmet in my hat. I say, ramming speed to the skeletons. Huh? Yeah. yeah. And then we board the them. Around and, starts them. Heading them. and then we board them. Spear ready. <laughs> it, it is now a trident. Nice. All right. Well, as Spear you're coming into view, flail ready. the catapult does take a shot at you. I'm going to send Gouji on this ship and just, like, do this. <laughs> Can I shoot? It does hit your ship, but it doesn't hit the mast. Can I shoot an Eldritch Bolt at the thing that's shooting is it, the ship? Is it close Not at enough? the range it's currently at. It's currently at catapult range. Ow. Like, it's not even at longbow range right yeah. now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. How big is the projectile? Projectile? It is a bowl around, which is basically two cannonballs with a chain between them, kind of thing. Mm. It's basically two big rocks with a chain, so when it gets flung, it spins around and basically catches and breaks masts and sails. Oh. Drive me closer, I want to hit it with is my it, axe. Is it on the deck? Is the thing on the deck? The, 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 ball? the, the, ball, the ball? The ball? Yeah. Uh, no, it swung through, clipped on the side of your ship and smashed a section of it off. Can Gouji go underwater and like go... Underneath your ship. He's not gonna run as fast as <laughs> No. <laughs> he does not have submersible mode. Dang. Yet. <laughs> Yet. <laughs> I like the URL. He, he also doesn't run as fast as his ship sails. No. So. I'll need to put propellers on them. <laughs> yeah. Can we get ourselves a catapult? Launch spiky. Uh, I don't think so, but not I right. might have something better. Uh, the ship actually fun. can be fit. Oh. Can, you actually can call it a catapult on the oh, ship. Okay. And can we launch Gouji at it? Yes. Can we launch? <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm going to... Yes. I'm gonna... Can, I, let's, can I get inside Gouji's... Like, you can armor. hang on the back of Gouji. Pulling up a ritual from the book, you can see a, a section of the back, the front of your ship. Actually, the floor kind of rises up and it generates what is basically a big bucket catapult. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, with that sound. It sort of folds out of the floor. <laughs> Okay. So, what stat do we use to fire catapults? I get, like I get intelligence, because, you know, you need to calculate mm. how... I can, I <laughs> Just trust the barbarian. Uh, I can gouge you. I would call it an intelligence check. Wow. Yeah, yeah, launching. No, Either intelligence or dexterity. And then, if we do miss, he just, like, football throws me into so the So, I should be the one who fires the catapult. If you want. And then you could, like, like rock, like, hook them back on. <laughs> it requires two people to operate. One mm -hmm. person to aim and fire, one person to work the winch. You can get one of the skeletons I'll to do the winch if you want. Oh, well, well, we, strong we people do, we handle okay, well, the guys, we do have a skeleton crew for this. <sighs> this exact job. Winching the thing requires some strength. The skeletons can do it, but if they're doing it, it would be faster. Never yeah. Bro, no, I got this. Yeah. Basically, you would be able to load it faster. Yeah. yeah, you got 20 strength, you got 22. I've, I've gone through 10 levels for this moment. <laughs> <laughs> My character is spent for this action. <laughs> Back yeah, labor. I min max to pull this winch. <laughs> yeah. All right, so I guess we each roll uh, a strength. Or yeah, you roll intelligence, you roll strength, you roll endurance. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Twenty-four. Mm -hmm. Woo! Oh crap! So you get a really big chunk and chunk of rock and throw it in there, or are you actually just using gouge? Gouge. We're using gouge. All right. And and yeah. as you as put gouge and set him no? in place correctly. <laughs> now gouge. This is a big <laughs> mission. And you might not come back. 23. Alright, right, right, Just know right, that we believe you in you. You up very easily. <laughs> and get into firing ready in one action. Make us proud. I got 14. 
<laughs> Farewell, Gabby. Oh, come on! I'm really sorry. I, I rolled a three on the die. You're, you're following Gouji after this. I will let you, if you want, spend an action point to re-roll Sean. Can yes, I I after my assist. speech. You can actually also roll intelligence to basically fine-tune this catapult thing to make it work better. Artificer it up. I just rolled intelligence. I'm hopping onto the catapult. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know if it's strong enough to fire both of you, yeah. but you could try. Nineteen! I hope. Right. Yeah, okay. you get, basically, you get an assist bonus. Twenty. Twenty. Oh yeah. Base. Right. Even with the minus two for Ragnar having climbed in there as well. <laughs> I rolled a two on intelligence. Yeah. <laughs> All my plan was actually yeah. Gally hold me and you football toss me under the boat. No, you're not. You're not going to do that. No, it's really? a terrible plan. Come on. What's the worst that can happen? You can swim, right? I would smash my face into the boat. You can hop off mid-air and go into the water. No, if he's the best case possibly. scenario is that you miss and hit the water. <laughs> <laughs> I'm he... sitting gouge, aren't I? Sheesh, guys. <laughs> we all no, have to make personal happens? sacrifices. Well, first of all, I need to check to see if Rangrim can land on this thing without crippling himself. <laughs> no, what? To be, no, to be fair, he's made of them so you're gonna rip your blood. arms off <laughs> you stop them and go jerk and dislocate your shoulder. You know what? No. No, I do that in front of you. Arm, no, maybe. dude. Try to you, you, will it. It. you will float. You will break your face. You float. You will float. float. You're wood. You're, you're wood. You're a tree. You are driftwood. Wood floats. I don't know, did you get the uh, point where you can wear armor over that armor yet? Uh, did I? I, I think I he, got, he got the thing where it, he doesn't in have to wear an armor anymore. Because the best thing you, you don't need to wear a shield. shield. I got one where I don't have to wear a shield. At the apex like, of, your, my, of your fist is a hammer. Your launch would be done. Uh, it doesn't say anything. Yeah, yeah. Armor it's yet. not quite armor yet. Okay, so you're still wearing your. Let's just see how much damage he takes. <laughs> <laughs> it's the oh, crit versus your fortitude. Oh, God! Oh, dear God. Remember, man, you chose this. Why am I rolling? <laughs> it's 39 damage. Oh, I see the video. <laughs> Do I. Can I roll luck to see if I land? 31 gun salute. Um, You've got plenty of health, man. You'll be fine. You just lost, what, half? I, I was actually just going to have that happen anyway. <laughs> oh, alright. For sure. You, come, you and Gouji come sailing in like a pair. Actually, roll me dexterity to see if you can nice. get on top of Gouji. <laughs> nice. Or in front, if you got. No, no, no. Behind. Oh, uh, behind. You don't want to get landed on. <laughs> you do not want to be in front of Gouji. <laughs> you don't want to not be in front. Not quite. <laughs> so you come screaming in like uh, some sort of horrifying <laughs> hell. <laughs> sailing in. You will actually slam through. You're actually... You're kind of unfortunate because you slam right into the front of the deck and basically roll down the entire length of the thing, <gasps> smashing through various drow who look very surprised <laughs> and are currently diving out of the way. You tumble down the ship and slam into their mast and basically knock the wind out of yourself. <laughs> You're on the ship, but you land in about the worst possible way. <laughs> oh. I call out. Meanwhile, Rango, Gouji, where are they? Daddy. Dear Christ! <laughs> Why don't you roll this way when I'm playing? <laughs> Did you crit? Yes. Yeah. I just crit twice in a row. Yeah. And I rolled it right there. We saw them. There. <laughs> Dear God. I made their perfect. ship take a shitload of damage. <laughs> <laughs> their mast is gone. Their mast is gone. So Gouji <laughs> takes 39 damage. <laughs> I'm gonna say you take five damage as Gouji lands, rolls down the boat the same path you took and lands into you, crushing <laughs> you between him and the mast. Aww, crushing damage, crushing damage. <laughs> you have more or less obliterated that section of their deck, though. There's now just like a hole. <laughs> you can't even really run across it. I'm gonna say Gouji flew in and he hit their catapult. <laughs> so it's gonna take them some time to fix that. Yeah, fucking. Ah, ah. I call I call out, hey Rangro, what, who's on the ship? What kind of people? And I don't hear him because I'm too far away. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> you know, be cool. Is Gouji still with his um, command if, range? If, <laughs> yeah, if you have <laughs> three <laughs> things, you, if you could give us things we can communicate to you, or communicate you with. That's just <laughs> stupid. I don't know, I mean... 
He rolled a two on his intelligence check. I don't think it occurred to him to do that. <laughs> but, there's, but there's tree brain. <laughs> no. There's two brains there. <laughs> Try using the flying zone around him. But no, the, the problem is the message goes to the tree and then the world tree talks talk to him. And it gets so, garbage. because it's, it's some otherworldly entity, it doesn't always understand the message. <laughs> so it's like playing that game of telephone. It's like playing a game of telephone with someone who doesn't really speak English. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> you could try. I mean, the vines are around this boat. We'll, we'll try some other time. You're not sure if it would work, but anyway. We have drought to kill. So we're trying to we're trying to get our ship closer to them in the meantime. Yeah, fun. Anyway. Uh, their ship is uh, continuing to move towards yours. It uh, appears to have slowed down somewhat. <laughs> so the damage is circulating around the mast area. Uh, I'm going to ghost down the prow of the boat, okay. ready to ju- ready, ready to jump. Your ship is moving fairly quickly. Actually, no, sorry. I, I go to the mast and grab one of those ropes, ready to do the hop thing. You have, at this point, moved into crossbow range. Yay! So if you want to fire a crossbow at them, you can. Can, I, can I fire a long bow? Uh, not quite yet. Range of ten. Yeah. What about a range? Long, a longbow has a range of twenty forty. Yeah. Twenty forty? Yes. Something like that. Yeah. Okay. Twenty squares, forty squares. Yeah. Okay, so I'm oh not in range. range. Currently, wow. currently, you're moving into about twenty squares off. Because I want to throw a fireball on that. Uh... <laughs> no, don't throw one on Gouji. No, because we want to loot the shit. Louis said Gouji and not Rangrim. Because <laughs> <laughs> you know, because you know, Gouji's made of metal. And Rangrim's only made of wood. wood. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Doesn't Rangrim... Whoa, 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 we used to have this this fire. <laughs> that was we a long time to, ago. <laughs> long time ago. A couple days. That was a couple days ago. <laughs> the uh, enemy ship is going to fire a couple of bolts at you, though. Mm. Mm. I like this red die. <laughs> I'm starting to think it might be rigged, because that's three in a row. Yeah. <laughs> What's the probability of that? I don't even um, know. It's one in 20 cubed. Yeah. Or one divided by 20 cubed. It's a lot. It might be 20 times 20. 20 times 20 times 20. Why do you hate oh. my party? <laughs> Bad red die. Uh, one in 8,000. <laughs> nice. <laughs> That's borderline history making right there. <laughs> they could officially used every scrap of luck out of that die. You <laughs> have a better probability anyway. of getting struck by lightning. Mm-hmm. Does the god crossbow bolt hit us? You, uh, you get hit. I get hit. With that bolt. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it. You take 18 points of damage. And you are slowed. Say that. I call out to the skeletons to maintain speed. And when we hit the ship, make sure we stay attached. Okay. Do they have like a like a hook? Yeah, the hook. Would yeah. Would you like to take a shot at the ship? I am going to get Gouji to do some. Um, Tell Gouji that. Can he go in a Can he go in a in a line towards the mast and and getting a couple? Well, he's right next in? to the mast. Oh. No, oh. he's crashed into it. <laughs> <laughs> Tell that. Gouji to pick up Rangram and use him as a club. No. <laughs> I'm okay with this. No. Like, I would stick out both arms. They're they're the ground ground ground. And they appear to be. They're moving away from Gouji quickly. <laughs> well. They're armed with. Uh, they have cutlasses, which are not drawn because they weren't expecting boarding. <laughs> uh, some of them are holding crossbows. Most of them look like they were just holding ropes and manning the sails and things like that. I'm pretty mm. sure. If there's, a, if there's a little cluster of them, toward the back of the ship, party, sort of like up that. on the poop deck by the <laughs> ship's wheel. In you can see a female girl wearing a captain's hat and wielding oh. a holding a large cutlass, which she has drawn and is sort of glaring down at you. Oh, <laughs> oh there's a female. Yep. The, the female captain. 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 Oh, you also good notice good uh, the emblem on their flag. Yeah, their flag. They're alive. Is a eight pointed spider, the symbol of Valf, flanked oh. by two red hourglasses. <laughs> well. Wait, can Gauss relay, relay that information to you? Yes. So are you going to tell me those are drow? Yes. Right hey, Azazel, it's, oh, it's a, it seems to be a drow ship headed by a drow warrior. <laughs> just, just so you know. <laughs> the description of the flag for you, Waldo, is yeah, that's the widow cutter. Hey, um, just a question. The other because crossbow bolt so fired into your crew uh, hits one of the skeletons. Ow. And when he goes, bunk. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he <rubs it's> <laughs> Skeleton, you shall be avenged. Um, He's not, he didn't fall down, he just went, kunk. he now has an arrow, bolt sticking out of his head. 
Peace can we'll get you into it. We'll take care of that later. <laughs> You're my buddy. You're my boy, Blue. Alright. You're my boy. Does it look Rango. like... Um, yeah, look. sorry. Uh, you two still have actions you can take. Yes. Uh, I... Does the mask look like it, it is something that could be destroyed by Gaudi? Yep. It would take some concerted work, but he could start trying to pull it down. Pull it off, yeah. Or just sort of top it, take all the ropes and Take all the, the sails off of it. Disconnect the ropes so that the sails go loose, so that it's not... Destroy the mast! <laughs> sure. Yeah. Roll me his punchy attack. <laughs> it is plus 14 to 10. Oh, yeah. What? I actually just meant the damage on it. Oh! <laughs> it's a mast. <laughs> well, it's like, a... <laughs> you're gonna hit it. The mast <laughs> god is... It's has been... <laughs> Um, nine plus six is so 15. fifteen damage, yeah. and it is well currently grabbed. <laughs> <laughs> um, the mask is grabbed. He's got his like, <laughs> trying to bear hug it. Um, because I'm so angry, can I just frenzy now? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Aww. But rage, Rangor. rage triumphs over all. You gotta get up. Oh. <laughs> Um, I also that was a stiff 20... battering on the old ribs. No, you're, you're, you're out of thumb. You're, 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 you're out of thumb. Really right yeah. Oh, yeah. So, you know. It's okay. Yeah, you're Am I in shouting range? range. Yes. I'm my own healer. Oh, yeah. Oh, by the way, no, never mind. I was going to say dissipate the fog, but, you know, really, that's just a waste of time. It's making it harder for me to hit you with bolts, yeah. too, so. <laughs> what is the closest drown? Uh, there's a couple that are almost right next to you who look currently panicked. They're like currently prone because they got knocked over in <laughs> the flailing, tumbling ball of Rangrum and Gouji. <laughs> with Rangrum's knowledge, is there anyone with me that he fertilizes? I'm going to attempt to pick up the prone drow. Okay. <laughs> Athletics check. <laughs> By the way, guys, can we keep the captain alive so I can talk to her? Mm, so you can question her, maybe. 30. I would be pressing against You are against currently grabbing a drow. But what do you I have to do with it? <laughs> sure. But I, I, don't, I don't mention torture to you. I mention questioning. Yeah. And then I'm going to take her below deck. See, that's more like it. Wait. <laughs> that's a two. <laughs> and you'll see me come out like 18. 18? Where, where is she? Huh? Don't worry about it. Sleeping. Yeah. Oh, okay. Right. You throw the drop. Sleeping with the skeleton. Morgan is incredibly gullible. Can they swim? Very gullible. My arms are made of over 100 year old scotch. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Is it better than his plan? Is he healing you or is it hurting you? You would put her up. You three have stuff you can do and beat her up. Alright. Eldritch uh, Bolt. Yet? No? Not quite. Ready, Eldritch Bolt. You should probably just use the catapult because I'm not yep. in range to do anything. Okay. And I'm not getting on that catapult. No, dude, dude, dude. Mm -hmm. Just wait. Can't you hear with the ropes with me? How about we toss skeletons on, on the ship? You could. No, no, <laughs> no, no, no. no. They're, fragile. Fragile. they're fragile. not really combatant. But they so. just combine back, <laughs> they'll scatter, and then they'll just come back. Skeletons, skeletons are fragile. And they're like, our right? crew. We protect yeah. our crew. Ten oh, okay, well, yeah, somebody's good. Good, like, I don't have that kind of range right now. The, I feel a connection. With you probably will next round, but your ships are still going to be great. can't be a number for me. Let's just get the catapult cool. going. Oh, okay. yeah. Catapult? Sure. Yeah. Give me strength. Woo! Uh, 18 plus. Sure. Whatever the hell 29. Sure. sure. I winched the hell out of that catapult. With a big old rock and you winch it up. Oh, can I come with you? 19 on the no, dive. No, 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 I'm not going. We're, we're not oh, okay. riding the catapult. <laughs> that is a horrible idea, as oh, demonstrated by Rainbow. On. He got there, didn't he? He got yeah. there. With, with help from both of these two, where he almost failed the freaking What'd roll. What'd you get? I got 30. 30? Oh, yeah. And <laughs> I'm aiming, uh... I'm thinking of aiming at the, cap at the wheelhouse with the captain. Toward the rear, where the captain is? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, I was going to say in the front of the ship. Right here, though. We're not in deep water, right? You actually are in somewhat deep water. Fuck. Hmm? You do not hit the captain. You do, however, destroy a large section of the rear of the deck. Mm -hmm. You're thrown off balance. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the ship is looking mighty damaged at this yeah, point. Yeah, they're like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Come at me! That's what you get! <laughs> Come at me, sister! Okay, um, uh, guys, FYI, I would like to not sink this ship. <laughs> so you can scavenge it for stuff? I gouge it down right now. So. No, <laughs> breaking the mass is fine. Mass, That's yeah. stopping it. Yeah. Destroying the complete hull, probably a bad idea. Oh, okay. Well, he's not, he's not destroying it. Yeah. 
Yeah, I've destroyed the wheelhouse, so yes. I can't move. Well, All don't right. worry, Matt, next turn will actually jump in there and be able yeah. to fight. Yes. The captain yeah. regains her footing mm. and hops down mm. from the rear castle of the ship, mm. and she's going to engage with Gouji, who's trying to screw with her ship's mast. No, Gouji! Gouji has no um, reaction. Wait, am I, am I next to Gouji? Yes. Mm. Mm. Ish. Because he... he I You're fairly close. Yeah, but you also didn't He's grab the guy to throw him over. Yeah. So Defenders are so you're, 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 you're not in the aura. She can basically go to the side where you are. Damn it! Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. No. She basically tries to stick one of her swords in the gun and start prying at it like a pry bar. Okay. Crowbars! <laughs> <laughs> Hooray! Not a crit. <laughs> Gouji has my defenses, though. It's 24 versus fortitude. Oh! Damn. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> He's also not really going in right, right now. Gouji gets stabbed. Gouji takes 18 points of damage. Yeah. Yeah. Tell Gouji to punch her in the face. face. Nope. Second uh, sword comes to cry does not find purchase. Okay. <laughs> Tell Gouji to Couple punch her in the face. Couple of drow. Uh, drawing cutlasses and moving in with anger. There are four of them. 30 and 26. That one, uh, one of the 30 hits. Okay. Um, and the two are a pair of misses. So you take eight points of damage as one of them cuts you, and you are slowed. Say that. Oh, make sure you save. Oh, yeah. You should actually save because you actually did take a turn. Mm -hmm. the, no, I don't save. Right. I'm you slow. are unconscious. Say that. Oh, no! Drow poison. Loader <laughs> <laughs> in the cat. How much did you say? Uh, eight. And you are also slowed. Say that. So. Uh oh. Go this is not poison though, this is from the AKX drum. Do I see Dorothy? Uh, the Dorothy uh, uh, Shaker, shaker. <laughs> yeah, shaker. can I, with, as, a, as a drow? I just gotta go down I'm gonna go do it. Uh, yeah, sure. I'm gonna use my uh, free, uh, uh, free action uh, daily on my armor Ten. for uh, healing surge. Can I get a bonus because I'm a drow? No. <laughs> but I you assist point. on the drow point. Point. That just means you know immediately what it is. <laughs> Aww. Not a ten. Right. Is this a kind of a poison? It is a poison. Uh, I have a potion of uh, poison help that gives me a plus five to save against poison. Wake up! Wake up! But does he know you have it? <laughs> we picked it up from a long time ago. <laughs> Do I know what it is? You, she might have mentioned what it is at some point. We do have to run into my coat. So. <laughs> Bottomless coat. Bottomless right. coat. <laughs> the two crow's nests on the other ship are going to fire both. Potion! Oh, oh, come to me! <laughs> And neither of them hit anything. They just thump into the deck. So. <laughs> and then it is... You just did your thing. Yep. You two. You are now within ten. Alright, so... I'm gonna throw three tennis balls on the ship. Uh, <laughs> Lightning bolt? Yeah. yeah. This one's gonna hit the captain, and these two are for each of the uh, guys in the crow's nest. Sure. Alright. Tennis balls! Okay, I'm going to assume the cat. Oh, no, oh, that's a uh, nine, nine, and a third. Nine against the captain, nine against one of the other guys. So, and plus what? Not plus what? Oh, sorry. Um, we need the modifier. Yeah, right. Plus 14 versus a reflex. So, so 23, 23. 23. You do not hit the captain, but you do hit the two guys in the crow's nest. Okay. And uh, are they minions or. Roll oh, damage. Okay. Right. Sea water. <laughs> All right. The ones with uh, <laughs> numbers on them are for one one yeah, guy. It's just standard ten weeks them off with a heal check. Okay. One guy takes six damage. The other takes seven. <laughs> or no wait. Uh, sorry, sixteen and seventeen. Okay. So she's not waking up. It's a kind of a uh, yeah. yeah. Did you did you manage to find the potion? With my my interaction, can I try and draw the potion from her? Sure. Sink it. You manage to find it. Rummage around and find the thing. Right. Which? Memories of the storm! <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm going to shout out the storm. Hold it down. Uh, wait, yeah. Did Please target it at the mast. There Should are two masts. One of the masts. Attack? Easy. One of the masts has a gouge holding it. The that's one. Okay. Gouge, that's although okay. gouge does have resist Ted Lightning. Yes, yes, that's what I was going to say. It's metal, so it's conductive. Woohoo! We just happened to try and fry it. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! This is true. Gouge. Just fry it with a yeah. metal sword, right? <laughs> yeah, that's good. Bring just it down the mast. Destroy the ship, please. Yeah. Each well, it's creature. gonna hit the ship. <laughs> I know, just don't destroy. Strength versus reflex. <laughs> the ship has no reflex. Well, Gouji. Oh, Gouji. Oh. No, Gouji has my reflex, but yeah. it's okay. He has resist 10. 20 versus reflex? Uh, on Gouji? 
It's 20 reflex hit gouge? No, it does not. But it can conduct so. <laughs> On the captain, roll. Nineteen. Mm. Can we use the same? Um, well. Yeah. Or is it the total bonus from the weapon? Um, so it's been a long time since I used this. <laughs> Your bonus to hit with that is plus fifteen. Ah, okay. so twenty-one. You should probably write next to the power plus fifteen <laughs> versus reflex. So twenty-one on this strike. Twenty-one on the captain. Yes, that uh, does not hit the captain. Are there any bonuses for conduct conductivity? No, it's so plus fifteen, and then my strength total. Or? No, just plus fifteen is the total. Okay, plus whatever you roll. Yeah. You do hit the ship, though. So what was the damage on the attack? Uh, fifteen. Okay, guys, no more AOE spells. <laughs> <laughs> Let's put that out there. Fifteen <laughs> plus eleven. Well, then you get in there and go like take out the captain. Oh, like, I'm, I'm doing. The, no, I, yeah, I know. I'm gonna. <laughs> We're not there yet. <laughs> I'm, trying weak, yet. I'm trying to weak. I'm trying to weak you up. <laughs> that mast is pretty badly splintered. It's got a scorch running down it. It's basically been split. The sails are currently on fire. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. It's probably not going anywhere. <laughs> As we're sailing, I go reduce speed because we have allies on that goddamn ship. <laughs> I just want to reduce speed. <laughs> no, no. Increase we don't, speed. We hit it. I jump off because we, we don't want to ram a ship you. with our allies on it and potentially harm them. Why don't go do something? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I say Wuss. reduce speed, but aim next to them so we can still hop on. Okay. I'm curious why you're reducing speed now that their ship's not sailing towards you. Sorry. So we're not ramming Redirect them ship to no longer ram. Going for a broadside then? Yes. Okay. Uh, did you do something? Yeah, you shot lightning bolts. Yeah, yeah something. That's all. Iron punches. Yeah. Around. Right. Yeah. Your ship is now basically close enough that you're basically the bowsprits of your ship are just passing by each other. You're just sort of starting to cross at the front. The two gentlemen in the crow's nest are unhappy with having been uh, shot with lightning bolts, and I want to mm -hmm. fire all them. I'm sorry, but okay. I'm still unconscious. I will be spending my minor action to dump the potion on you. Uh, uh, Thirty and just twenty-five. For just just, 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 just jam it down and uh, run. What? Just run away. Thir <laughs> Thirty <laughs> and twenty-five. They both. I'm sorry, but they're close enough for me to hurt. Therefore, I you need take to sixteen out. points of damage, and you are slowed save it. Uh, okay. bolts. I use flickering uh, form. It's actually it's two attacks, each doing eight. Oh, so we okay. only have one of them. All you right. might want to save that. Yeah. <laughs> or wait, no, wait, I forgot. Shield. So only one of them hits. Okay. Eight damage. Okay. Yeah, it's load save hits. Okay. Yeah. The other gentleman in the pirates, Captain, is going to continue trying to pry, pry a gouty. No. That is not successful. Yay. And that is successful. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm going to command myself. Should I tell myself? No. I'll say it's time to hide. Man, we got this. Gouchy takes drow. 18 points of damage. Mm-hmm. Pride, 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 pride. What do you mean just drow? Yeah. Then you just drow who ran over it. Yeah, yeah, just wimp. Okay. And miss him horribly. Yeah, you're pretty human. Don't worry the about it. The other drow sort of hit the rear mast. I'm not going to line up across those items. My skin's lightning. One of those is over here. My hair's turning yellow. It's 32 versus your AC? Yep. Yeah, and the other one is 27. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. I have, I, I'm Eight damage and slow save us. <laughs> this is a different kind of slow effect. It overrides the old one. Oh. Hmm. Because it's worse. <laughs> because. Just because. So, I have two slows that I have to deal with? No, mm. just one. The new one overrides the old one. Oh. Anyway. Uh, you guys. Us. Oh, yeah. Do I get a do I get a save okay. against wait, wait, wait. the conscious? No, no. First, first, yes. Before that, though, I oh. I, I take I have the potion. I jam it into her mouth. Okay. <laughs> right, and then I, I take on running. Roll right. me on my I'm side. Serious. I'm not choking. You roll your save with plus five. Yeah, that does that does it. Right. Put the potion. You wake up. Uh, <laughs> uh, Am I still slow? <laughs> you are not slow. Okay. Right. You see the bottle is inside your mouth. I take a running leap off the boat, axe up, and try to bring it right down on one of the drops. Sure. Roll me athletics. Plus two for us. Twenty. Twenty? Yep. Alright. Swing for one lucky son of a gun. And again, plus two for us. <laughs> Cock guy. Twenty on the die. I mean, no, twenty. Twenty total. I mean, twenty, 20 total, sorry. Right. On the die is crit. Yeah. Right. That will hit one of the little 
Pirates, who is currently looking over at you, who had like a cutlass, he's like, ah! 27 <laughs> damage. <laughs> yeah, he's, I think he's just dead. <laughs> you cut him soundly in half. <laughs> I jump off the prow, tiny wait, 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 wait. tiny uh, uh, next to the captain. So like, when I jump off, I'm, it's, it's just the point at which I'm closest animals? to the captain. Okay. And I run to her. Before I, no, everyone starts back. running into you things, I want to use the off. shock sphere. I, I want to know how many people I can hit with that. You can hit a fair few. They're currently clustered on the deck. You could probably hit about four of them. Okay, so I'll roll. Assuming you don't want to hit allies. Yeah. If you're well, willing to hit allies, you could also hit the captain. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, <laughs> Just, uh, it's four of them either way, right? Uh, either four of them or four of them and the captain. Mm. And Ragnar McGavity. <laughs> Are you using a lightning bolt? Uh, shock sphere. Oh. <laughs> and yeah, I'll just uh, go for the wuss option. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the party friendly option. Pretty sure Ragnar's taking a lot of damage. Yes. Alright. So, lowest one is uh, 18 versus reflex. Nope. Okay, that misses. Uh, nine, 23 versus reflex. That'll hit. Okay, so that's three hits with 17 lightning damage. Okay. Your dice are very hard to read. Or at least two of them are. Yeah, the, I need to paint the... Oh, yeah. Fill in the things here. You shock the crap out of four of the, uh, sort of, what look like more... They don't really look like soldiers. They look more like <laughs> crewmen, really. Oh, God. They're not as heavy on... They're still drow while worshipping cultists. <laughs> yeah. I don't they're well, just not I'm, really fun. There's no moral dilemma. Like, well, they ha- they I'm are trying armed. to hit the people who are fighting my guys at the well, moment. Well, they're, they're armed. They won't okay. start fighting. It's just they're not very skilled. <laughs> okay. These guys worship Wolf and are known for torturing people, healing them, torturing them. Label. This particular group is not known for torturing people. They're known for sacrificing people on altars. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Probably yeah. lies. Yeah. <laughs> so, no What's more the point dilemma? of sacrificing a No, no, it's not about the moral dilemma. I'm trying to get the most effective people first. <laughs> Myrtle Myrtle. That'd be the captain. <laughs> yeah. Myrtle Myrtle. Captain and the people in the crow's nest. Alright. The two guys that were crewing the catapult are also skilled, but they're skilled at using the catapult. <laughs> yeah, okay, wait. So, I hop off, and, I, and I've used both actions. Am I close enough to hit her at this point? No, you force fed her. Yeah. Round to the front of the boat, and that was done. Ah. Damn, You're not on my saving throw. Action point. I'm going to action point. Did you fail? Yeah. Well, you are unconscious. Say that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to action point and charge. Okay. Sure. Charge. Roll an athletics to hop between the boats. Can you do acrobatics? No. <laughs> it's simply a question of whether you can clear the gap. 21. Yep. Easily. Okay. And charge in the captain? Yep. Okay. Fortunately, the crewmen who are between you just got shock speared. <laughs> nice. <laughs> They're all currently lying on the ground. Going, ah. <laughs> Would I be flanking her because Gouji is between me and her? Well, Gouji was at the mast. Or, yeah. She came down. She's probably mast, Gouji, her, and like Rainer's probably over here somewhere. So you would probably be around. No, nah, you wouldn't. Where's be our ship in relation to? Over here. Okay. Damn it! All right, uh, that's gonna miss. All right. I'm not even bothering it. <laughs> I actually had a map for this, but we don't have time to do map yeah. combat. We have ten minutes. Yeah, exactly. Five. <laughs> There's a reason oh that God. all these drow have suddenly become much less competent. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you kill something? Do you uh, do something? Wait, he did the, what about me? He did the lightning bolt. Yeah. 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 Oh, that's who I forget. He I did lightning bolt. Oh, the jumps, right? How about you? Oh, or a guy that I can pick up that happens to be on fire. Yeah, there's a couple of flaming blanks. Woohoo! One of them's got an ale in it. Spray it to the captain and go. <laughs> <laughs> I love nice. it. <laughs> the fighter version of a fireball. Yes. He's gonna roll basically a save kind of thing. Yeah, <laughs> she's blinded. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, right, uh, minor second wind. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> Does Gouji have any sort of healing surge? Uh, you spend a healing <laughs> You spend no, a healing it surge. doesn't heal. It's oh. a robot. No. It needs to be fixed. If he's really close, he gets 20 temporary hit points, but that's about it. <laughs> he um, says making little can I, can I have him, can I have him um, do a breath weapon on, the, on a cluster of enemies and then trample his way back closer to me to heal? Uh, uh, totally. Yes. If you do a breath attack, you hopefully direct it from us. Just 
just saying. Yeah, yeah, just just not at you guys. Yeah, if there was a cluster at her of her mostly. Yeah, yeah. If there's a if there's a cluster of dudes, um okay. Fourteen versus fortitude. Uh twenty versus fortitude. Twenty fortitude on her. We'll hit her because she's blinded. Oh, okay, she is immobilized save ends. Okay. Uh I'm just gonna trample her and get closer to back to the ship. But right. I get plus five because it's a poison, right? Yep. Can I run over her and anybody else in the way? Yeah, probably one or two. Okay, right. I'll, um, and damage, if any, 18, 11, and 9. I'll let you distribute. And I'll count up the I don't damage. Need to. Don't say that. It's, it's basically all in Rangram okay. and or. <laughs> uh, 26 uh, or damage. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Plus 6 is <laughs> 32 damage. Okay. And fall from. <laughs> Travel a couple people. Well, the captain's not having a good day. Yeah, is Probably he not close enough ish? <laughs> Is he close enough ish that I can give uh, Trampy, uh, Gouji? No, uh, Gouji can, take some, no, Gouji can yeah. take some of those Tampa points. If you she was better. close enough to the uh, Thunderstruck, she might be deafened, too. <laughs> <laughs> Probably is. Yeah, yeah. So stack up the effects. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so she's just like, oh, yeah, yeah, so yeah, she's yeah, like yeah. basically deaf, dumb, and blind now. <laughs> she's not dumb. <laughs> <laughs> she can talk. She's screaming, in fact. She's yeah. yelling very loudly. <laughs> well, she was stupid enough to attack us, so I'd she's say she's pretty dumb. Every drow swear there is, and has invented a few. Even you're kind of going, gee, that's a bit excessive. Pretty <laughs> much, yeah. We don't need to talk to her any further, I don't think. Are you going to do your thing? What do you mean, torture? Huh? Oh, yeah, you blew that. Uh, there's no mention of torture, 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 so. Yeah. Yeah. I did. I already did a, a scotch fire. The captain is going to stand up and basically blindly swing at Gouji. <laughs> Woo! Hasn't Gouji has trampled away though? This does not experience much help. No. I know you go along with explain why she's not hitting it. <laughs> <laughs> She'll actually go and swing at Rankroom and miss horribly. Oh, okay. <laughs> you now have a blind captain next to you. Yeah. Uh, Guys, Bowman. KOs if possible. A couple of them shooting at Wit. Uh, one of them probably hits him. 28 versus AC. Hits. Alright. You take a total of 16 damage and your slow would save ends. Ooh. Yeah, you want that save. Yeah, you don't want to fail that save. No, I did not. It sucked. I got slapped, it feels like. Yeah, the other two are going to shoot. I don't know what happened there. Uh, one of them's going to hit Ringer for 8 damage and slow save ends. <laughs> don't worry, they'll run it out of the other direction. Pay attention to the fact that. How are you doing like, every health battle wise? We've ever I have had. 80 health. Out of 88. You're good. Is, is this continuing to occur? I have an item which, uh, hmm. when I use what? my second What does it occur for every battle since we got together? Is it continuing to occur? Just, uh, that you're not getting hit? <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah. Just this. I love how you complain about your lack of being shot. <laughs> you realize part of my character is designed to be bloodied. <laughs> including the abilities you gave me. Hey, hey, you, you hey. said no to the chance of you being catapulted onto the other ship, so... Oh, yeah, you could have done that, man. You could have done that. Wait, well, but no, let's go. Let's go. You're getting attacked now. <laughs> watch it. Watch the crit. Grab, three ground pirates come over to attack you. <laughs> <laughs> Two that <at> once. <laughs> come on. Oh, that's an actual roll. Ready. That is 19 on the die. Two of them just kind of collided to each other, <laughs> comically. You take 15 points of damage. Okay. One of them stabs you. Thank you. I do help you. Then it is you guys' action. Yay! I swing at the closest drow. Sure. I suppose the only thing I can do is try to not die. Try to wake up to it. <laughs> I do. 25. Woo! Okay. Oh yeah, you hit one. <laughs> 20 damage. Yeah, probably finish that guy off. Should I bother power striking? <laughs> no. <laughs> How many crew members are left? Uh, there are. I can sense seven left. Action point. Can I swing it as near by one? Sense. I can. Two of the guys in the crow's nest look pretty hurt though. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna go after the captain. Uh -huh. Well, uh, if you guys want to take your actions first, because I'm, I'm gonna let you guys go ahead and give me any advantages you guys can give. <laughs> Rankroom can circle around and give you a flank, but... <laughs> no, I mean, like, because like, everyone deafened and blinded them. And that. So I'm like, oh, okay, well... It reminds me, she needs to roll saves against some of that stuff. <laughs> oh, Still blind? Save too. Still immobilized? Oh, fuck. Still deaf. <laughs> Fail my save. You're I would like to point out, I just rolled three nat threes in a row. Yeah. This die is hexed. <laughs> It's probably because you rolled 20s on it the past, the first yeah. couple of times. No, it's not even that. It's the fact that it keeps rolling the same number several times in a row. Another 1 in 8,000. <laughs> yes. To, to be fair, dude, that is weird. with this d20, I rolled two ones on initiative, which resulted in a zero initiative. Yep. So... <laughs> Wait, um... 
Yeah. I'm just gonna attack. Yep. I'm next door, right? You can run next door. Alright, so I'm gonna next door. Um, uh, I'm gonna flame her spirit. Alright. Hey, another three. <laughs> Apparently, this is contagious. <laughs> she is blind, so. It's close to. Okay, cool. Well, you know they say about power of threes. 20 versus reflex? No. <laughs> Her reflex is high. <laughs> I would be glad if someone blooded me right now. Right, Herman Morgan. So Alright, um, I'm going to try and hit the captain. Definitely blind. We still my does. Bow. And immobilized. Still I miss. Sure. Try and give her a deep buff on her safe. Actually, it, it, you can either 24 miss or just versus um, will. Actually, yep. reflex, so I did uh, Doing 11 damage, okay. but she takes a minus 2 to all saving her throws until the end of my next turn. <laughs> Just because. It's just mean. It is mean. I'm mean. Rangram? Cat Rolly plus Blunter Fist? The captain's next to you. So. Yeah. She's blind though, so she can't make up. Can I tell Gouja to go and just like total defense? And I'll save my throne for the defense next week. Spider Fist. You, t- you have to take actions to command him though. Uh, can that be a move action? Yes. Total defense is not a move action. Oh, okay. I'll Standard. Sure. I'll you can tell him to move around. But. Yeah. Um, were there any drows that were one or more, or like within range of me, other than the captain? Oh, I might still. Yeah, probably. Swing so one of them too. I get two attacks. Sure. With the same, with like just two different. Attacks. Nineteen versus the blind deaf drow. No. <laughs> <laughs> still no, really. Uh, mm-hmm. Really. Yeah. Twenty-one versus reflex on a normal. Person. Let's just say you hesitated because you didn't. You thought she suffered enough. <laughs> hey guys, it's time. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Uh, 20 dollars coming soon. Oh, okay. sorry. 25 damage. Huh? Let's just say she's disabled. She's well enough disabled. Yeah. I'll say you guys can probably sack up the rest of the crew pretty easily. Yeah, and then now it's time to talk to her. Apparently. Most of them are hardly interested in fighting her death. Some of them quit, in fact. No. No? None of them quit. No. <laughs> they're helpless. <laughs> Most of them swear at you while they're being sad. <laughs> Uh, none of them wanted to surrender. You know, if any of them gets they're, out, they're gonna they really are dumb stories then. about um, the It's not so much dumb the, as the they're cultists, mm-hmm. and also their captain is not their only boss. Mm-hmm. <laughs> if they surrender, There's bad no gifts would happen. Did I kill the drow I just hit? Hmm? Did I kill the drow? If you want to. Yes. I can only Did imagine you telling then? stories. Okay, so they're gonna be sacrificing people to their volcano oh, god. But we didn't use your ship map. No. Although you can take a look Aww. at what the ship looks like. It is a giant ship. Is this one ours? As that was the mast you slammed into. That yeah. was the catapult. You made this line here. <laughs> There's like cargo hatch here. The captain hopped down and rushed you. There's yeah. little crossbow mounts everywhere. Mm-hmm. Each crow's nest has three crossbow mounts in it. That's why they were starting to shoot. Hey four guys, looks like there's them. an interior where yeah. we could like... There is an interior. Gee, I, I wonder what's inside. Loot. The interior mostly has crew quarters. Oh. Loot. Oh, I'm gonna do the we'll same pay. thing I did to every ship. I'm gonna instantly go to the captain's quarters. We'll do that next time. Yeah. It's so cold out there. <laughs> that was in Mexico. That sucks. <laughs> well, that's your problem. <laughs> that's your problem. Going somewhere where the weather's nice. <laughs> oh, yes. I...